associate and in today's show it's all about the Sunday highlights so I'll be featuring bags that have been featured on our website a small little recap from previous shows as well as um, a sneak peek of a couple of new items that have not hit the website and they're vintage as well so if you're a vintage fan do stay on so how it works it's very very simple you um, watch our live shows and as we are uh, discussing the products feel free to ask us questions uh, we'll be demonstrating uh, all the items and giving you a condition report and then the price will be revealed and the way to shop is that the product icon will appear on your top left hand corner um, all you need to do if you're interested in that item is to click on those buttons um, they are interactive and it'll take you straight to the website where you can see further images and um, also add to cart we take all major forms of credit and debit um, cards as well as PayPal and split it so split it is an affordable and easy way to manage and spread those uh, luxury purchases over three, six and nine and 12 months interest free. That's right, interest free. So it just makes it a bit sort of manageable with your finances. However, it's only available on credit card and you must have the full amount available on your credit card before you check out. And also we ship worldwide. Uh, it is £10 within the UK, Europe is £15 and the um, rest of the world it is £35. And one other thing, we also cover all your customs and duties. So if you're uh, shipping outside the UK, for example, America, Australia, Asia, or even Europe, we pay your customs. We land those goods for you. So there's no extra taxes on top. The only surcharge you need to pay is the shipping, and that's it. So we've got a few people joining us. We've got Natalie. Hi, Natalie. We also have Lisa Jane. And uh, we have Nilsa, and we have, uh, who else? Oh, it's our regular, I hope it's our uh, customer services, uh, Natalie. And I'm actually joined by the lovely Sarah, who's our weekend so so sales associate. Yes. yes. And do you love designer bags, Sarah? I live and breathe designer <laughs> bags. I literally love them. <laughs> do you remember your very first designer bag? I do. And what was it? A Lady Dior. Really? Yes, that was my absolute first piece, and I bought it when I was like 17. Wow. So, yeah, very old. It was what colour? Um, I got it in black. Yeah. yeah. Oh, amazing. It, it was with the 24 karat gold building at the time. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful. So that was your proper face first paycheck? Yeah, I'd say so. Yeah. Yeah, 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 completely. I um, saved up all my money. I went to do on Selfridges at the time. Oh. Spent all my money. Still have it. <laughs> In one hand, out the other. <laughs> completely, completely, completely. Amazing. Now, I want to ask everybody here, what was your very first designer bag? Please let us know. And was it your first major... Um, say you saved up for it what did you buy was it vintage or brand new I would love to know also I mustn't forget I need to introduce Vivian who is moderating for us tonight give us a shout Vivian hi guys <laughs> so now we, oh we have Pia Jo Pia Jo is all the way from Finland oh, and she's a hi. huge uh, vintage fan uh, who else is here uh, we have uh, lots of people just joining us so ah Dipti said she, hers was a black uh, first. Her bag was a black lady Dior as well. Oh, wow. Was your one well, black? Yes, exactly. Yes. yes. And so let's start with. Having said that, yes. let's start. With this. Let's do a little surprise unboxing. Yes. Yes. Let's go back to when you were seventeen years old, Sarah. <laughs> yes. <we're next. laughs> yes. <laughs> so when you were seventeen, yeah, you got this box and you we opened it up and guess what? Very it is a Lady Dior. Obviously, this is not your Lady Dior. No, no, no of course it isn't. Not. It is um, something that we have on our website. It's in beautiful condition, as you can see. It comes with a dust bag and box, so it comes almost full set. Yep. Um, and this is a patent leather Lady Dior. Oh, so is that a medium? It is a medium size, yeah. yeah. Medium size. So it's a medium size. It's in excellent condition. It features the uh, palladium hardware, silver hardware. Nilsa is saying her first designer bag was from a cruise in P Bermuda and it had an LV store. Uh, she bought the Eva uh, limited edition Neverfull and an, a limited ed edition Neverfull and a Marina Hobo. Uh, Oh, that's good. Good choices. Good choices. Good choices. Very good choices. And what's great about shopping abroad, and also obviously in Bermuda, it's probably tax-free tax at the time. Free. Yes. 
It's like me at uh, Terminal 5. Yes. All the designer shops there. That was me. That was me too. <laughs> so, yes, this is beautiful, this paint and Dior. It is absolutely stunning. Uh, it comes with the box and, importantly, guys... The strap. Yes. So, do they come with the strap uh, or you have to buy these separately, no, Sarah? No, the, the old ones, they used to come with a shorter strap, which I much prefer because yeah. it's very comfortable on the shoulder. Yeah. The newer ones, you can adjust it so you can make it more like crossbody. Oh, uh, yeah. so there's a two-way option. There's a two-way. So but they some... do come, even the newer ones, they do actually come with the strap. So this is obviously an older model. This is an yeah, older one. Yeah, because this is a fixed strap. Yeah. But most importantly, it comes with um, the, uh, the, the the straps. Completely sealed as well. Yeah, it looks like it's never been used. I don't think it has. And also an interesting thing about the new uh, older models, older models was a zip. Zip, yeah. exactly. And the newer models now is a fold. Fold, exactly. Yeah. So that is the main difference. Uh, it is, I'm not going to take out stuffing, but it is excellent condition. If appears to be hardly being used. Oh, the and seals are still on. Yeah, the on seals, the yeah, I could just show you. The seals are still on, on the front and it has all the Dior charms as well. Um, it's, you know, this is paint and leather and I actually quite like paint and leather. It's very practical I leather. Do. I do, especially yeah. for British leather as well. Exactly, you can sort of wipe down um, and it's easy to maintain and look after. So, yes. So this is for scale. I am a five foot, uh, three and a half, almost four. And this is what it looks like on me. I think medium is actually a very good size. Very nice size. Yeah. Uh, Sarah, who is a bit more petite, she will demonstrate. Five foot. Yeah, you're five foot. Yeah. yeah. And it actually looks great. Yeah. Like, it, really doesn't, nice. it doesn't overwhelm you. No. At all. So this, as a recap, comes with its dust bag and box. It's rated as very good to excellent condition. Corners are immaculate. Yeah. And the uh, seals are still um, a, a bit on the hardware, especially on the Lady Dior charm, yeah. as well as the uh, shoulder straps. So the sh shoulder strap still has its original seals as well. And in a moment, the price will be coming up. Yep. Yeah. The price of this near perfect uh, quick, uh, Dior black patent bag is £2,250 or uh, 2,950 US dollars, and the uh, product icon will just appear in any moment. There it is. And all you need to do is just tap on that icon. That will take you to the website where you can shop um, with um, straight away or see further images and the product information on that bag. And remember guys, the, the price also includes the duties and taxes. So, so what is this? Yes, it is a lovely piece. So let's move on to, we're kind of getting into the mood of summer. We are. Yeah. We have brand new, never been worn. Da, da, da. All round sandals. Yeah. These are beautiful. Do you have a pair of all rounds? I do. I have a few colours actually. I oh, think cool. they go with everything. They are so comfortable, aren't so, they? Yeah, so I've got a gold pair. Yeah. And I can't wait to get my feet out again. Yeah, they're, uh, they're so nice. I think that these also go with like, dresses. They go with jeans, culottes. I think it's the perfect shoe. Yes. Uh, this is in black swift with the contrasting um, cream stitching. And this is a size, what size is it? 37. It's a far, size 37, 37, which is a UK 4 now. Yeah. Um, like I said before, they're brand new, never been worn. This is our last pair we have available at Luxury Promise before we... Um, so um, grab them if you can. And do you think they fit a true to size? I do. I think they are true to size, yeah. Yeah. So obviously at 38, you can't... No, I wouldn't say so. So if you were 36 and a half? I think so, yeah, 36 and a half is perfect, 37, even if you're 37 and a half, you can definitely fit into them. So, um, you heard it from Sarah, who has several pairs, mm -hmm. you, what size shoe are I you? I usually actually get 37. You are, yeah. okay. Yeah. So definitely fits true to size, but there is a little bit of leeway from anything from a 36 and a half to 37 and a half. So if you're three and a half to four and a half foot, half foot yeah. definitely it will fit you fine. Because it's a mule open back, um, you have a little bit of leeway at the back of the heel. If you, um, so uh, brand new, never been worn, includes dust bag. And, um, and the price will be coming up shortly. Show you the condition one more time. It 
see there's hardly anywhere. These are £475, which is uh, 622 US dollars. And it's available to purchase. You just need to tap on that icon. And remember, if you're shopping from outside the UK, we do, land, um, do cover your customs and duties. So the only surcharge you need to cover is uh, shipping. And then that's it. So it's available now. It's our last pair, guys. So if you're 36 or 37 and you've been looking for a pair of classic black, Really grab them now. Uh, right, this is a really nice Dior bag. And I think this is actually very you, Sarah. It is actually, I really yes. like it. Perfect um, for spring, summer. Definitely. So, is that my showing? Yes. Yeah, sure. yeah. So, this is in beautiful, clean condition, as you can see, considering it's a white piece. Is it a brand new piece? Um, it's not brand new, but however, it's pre owned. However, it's been well looked after. Very well looked after. Yeah. And it's a size mini, I believe. Is yeah. it the mini? Yeah. Let me get my measuring tape. Sure. It's the perfect size inside. What perfect to fit your everyday goods library. with your credit cards. Lots of space and compartments on the inside to put change. It definitely fits an iPhone, I believe. Yeah. It will do. Yeah. It is 20 centimetres across, which is equivalent to about seven and a half inches so it's a real it's equivalent to like a chanel classic one yeah isn't the, it? The, yeah, yeah exactly i'd say so yeah and one thing really that i love about these is that you can style these in so many different ways yeah so firstly you can of course hold it as a clutch perfect dinner evening bag yeah um cross body which of course on me it's going to be a bit more longer yeah Oh, it's a really nice practical bag. It's so practical. Yeah. And what I like, with my wallet on chains, I always make the chain a bit smaller. Let me just put the thing. Did you do that bit? No, really! No Amazing. Amazing! Sorry, we've gone a bit wonky. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the Dior bag has just yes, sold. sold. Please let us know who bought that bag. Um, is it your, it, remember, actually, if you've caught our story earlier, Sarah, your first designer yes. bag was a Lady Dior. Yes, I was. wonder if it was your first designer <laughs> bag. Please let us know. Well, congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> You're gonna love it, it's beautiful. So as I was saying, you can shorten the chain Sorry. Um, and have it as more of a height crossbody like this. And also, this is oh, how this I is would cute. do it. Yeah, it's just really Oh, cute even like doubled up. That's yeah. doubled up. Yeah, and even if you want to make it crossbody, you can just make it as a shorter crossbody. Oh, I see. That's, that is really nice. Really nice. Yeah. That is a really, really beautiful bag. I mean, guys, the condition is amazing. It comes with it's the original box. box as well as dust bag. It's the uh, Diorama. I think it's called Diorama. Yeah, it's a Diorama. Uh, white calf skin. It's in wonderful condition. It is a pre-owned piece. However, it has been well looked after. There's hardly any wear, is hardly, there? Hardly, hardly. Hardly any wear. I've actually got the bigger size Diorama. Mm -hmm. um, I actually prefer it more than a boy bag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 they're actually... The yeah, because I think they're quite lightweight. They are much yeah, lighter, much. Yeah, right. yeah. So... That's my opinion. So, uh, yes, yeah, so it has that excellent hardware. If you push it open, oh, it's so nice inside. So nice. I mean, it's got everything. Be I love that contrasting. I one. do. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, my Diorama is this color. I love it. Yeah. And what, what's the inside leather like? Um, it was blue, it was all matching. All blue, but yeah, yeah, but this one's contrasting, which is quite nice. Yeah. Also, guys, it comes with this little card as well. So, a handy little card as well. So, it's been really, really well looked after. I So, earlier on, Sarah showed, um, demonstrated what it looked like on her. You are five foot. Yes. So, for size, I'm about five foot three and a half. Um, this, actually, the length is just perfect on me. And it, I would wear it as a crossbody style yeah. bag. But I love the way... How did you do that, the, the strap? So, I base, all you need to do on the inside is just literally... Like that, just double it Oh, up so on you inside. cross it, cross yeah. it over. Yeah, literally like that. I and see. It makes it perfect for my height. Oh, that's great, and that, that yeah. actually is a really good length as a um, shoulder bag yeah. as well. Brilliant. And before we reveal the price, I've just noticed something else that's an amazing bonus to this bag. The chain is detachable. Nice. That is really nice. So you can actually 
detach the chain, remove the chain, and use this as a clutch or as a wallet. 100%. Yeah, so amazing. there's so many options. I mean, cost per wear, guys, this is definitely um, a good um, investment bag, and I think you're going to get loads of usage, and you're definitely wear, uh, worth the money, yes. I think. Yeah. So the price of this bag, it is only £700. Such a good price. That price. is such a good price. Now, I mean, Dior wallets on its own is uh, £700, yeah, pounds, they right? Are, yeah, yeah. So it's £700, pounds, which is 918 US dollars. I think that is a steal. Less than $1,000, less than £1,000. It includes its dust bag box, a card inside. I would rate this as very good to excellent condition and um, definitely cost per wear. Yeah. And it's, 700 for a Dior, impossible. It's impossible. 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 Yeah, exactly. So if you love this bag, you like to see further Im images and information on this bag, you just need to tap on that icon and it'll take you to cart and take it from there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and remember guys, we are covering your customs and duties. So even more reason to shop with us and stay on this show. So let, I'll let you choose something, Sarah. Oh, uh, what should I pick? Actually, do you know what? I really like these. I yeah. know. I saw you trying them on. I really, I really yeah. like these. So we have these beautiful Oran, uh, not Orans, mules uh, with, oh, I think they're beautiful, yeah, aren't they? Yeah, so I'll, I'll let you yeah. have that one. So these are pretty much never been worn, brand new. Um, Colour is this blue again? It's more like um it's like a baby blue, but it yes, isn't. Like Scar <sighs> would you say sky? Yeah, if so if Sabrina's watching this show, I know she's just about to board a plane. <laughs> if you can just let us know the colour, that would be great. Or any of the community down here, I'm sure you guys will know the colour. But basically, these are beautiful um, mules, moccasin style mules with the palladium Kelly lock, beautiful. which I love. And Tiny. it is actually a fully functioning lock. It is. It really works. So I'm just I'm not gonna undo the whole thing, but it definitely works. And I just love. Oh my gosh, look at the print. The inside, that's what I was going to say next. It's... Look at the print. That's almost like a work of art. You're putting your feet inside a work of art. <laughs> it's a stunning, sort of almost, um, it's almost psychedelia type of print inside. And these are excellent condition, never been never worn. worn. Never worn. Size 36. Yes, size 36 which is a UK uh, three. UK 3. So even if you're on the cusp of 36 and a half, yeah. these will fit fine on you because there is because it's an open back, you, there's a slight you, you know, there is a little bit of um, leeway for um, over the uh, over the back heel as well. And these are excellent condition, never been worn. And I think they retail for over a thousand, right? Yeah, I think these are I think twelve hundred yeah, actually. Yeah, that's what I think. Yeah, twelve, twelve or fifteen hundred. I I think around the twelve. Twelve hundred. Yeah. yeah. Do so you have the price? Yes. Yeah, and the price will be revealed very shortly. It has its own dust, dust bags bag. as well. It's got everything. Oh yeah. look, it's even got the little Kelly protector. Yeah. That's probably that's worth. Really that's probably worth a hundred pounds on its own. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just show one more time ah the price is only 750 pounds uh, which is uh 983 us dollars they are for a U, uh, eu 36 or a uk3 and these are yeah natalie these are so cool are. so all you need to do is just tap out that icon and it will take you to the website where you can see further images okay amazing that's cool uh, let me do another pair of shoes. I'll choose one this time. Um, they're cool. These, they're, they're you, are, really. these are so cool. <laughs> yeah, cool. Oh my gosh. Actually, guys, I actually have the matching handbag. I know, that's why I just said this. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have, have the matching. So and unfortunately, I, I would have bought these, but they're just slightly too small for me. But they are so, so cool. So if you love trainers, I pretty much wear trainers every day to the point that now I'm thinking I might get it a posher brand because <laughs> I actually wear them every day you do you yeah wear a lot of trainers. yeah do. I go and put on heels and I'm like I don't think my feet can take this <laughs> I need to go in trainers they see you so. yeah so um these are Chanel uh running trainers and I just love the fact that they have the tartan print this is the Harris tweed and this is from the collection where um Chanel I think it was 2015 where they went to um the collection was all about Scotland okay so hence the tartan Harris tweed but what I love about it what makes it so fun 
Look at the tweed effect on the laces, which is so, so much fun. And the uh, contrasting bronze and gold leather on either side. They're just so, so cool. Yeah, the laces are really cool. Yeah, they are really, really cool. So um, these are pre-owned. They have been worn, lightly worn, but generally in good, clean condition. And these are size 38 and a half which is a five and a half. Five and a half, yeah. yeah. Chanel shoes, I find they actually are a bit narrow. Okay. So even though it says 38 and a half, I think if you're 38 UK or size UK for, for five, these will fit you fine. These will be, you know, they will have no problems. Comes with its dust bags. I've got two sets of dust bags here. And um, I like the fact that the soles are um, gold as well. And they're very good clean. And I love that Chanel little detailing there. Where was that? Beautiful. Oh yeah, that is so cute. Really cute. That is so cute with the CC detail there. So, um, just light wear, light wear to the toes, light wear to the soles, but generally in good clean condition. Um, it's no, it's not worn. I think they still have a lot of life in them yet. And these are size 38 and a half and would be ideal for a size UK 5, five. or a, a 38. And they're only 395 pounds. That is, you know, me and Vivian were actually saying today that Chanel trainers are like now eight hundred pounds. So this eight hundred and eighty nine hundred pounds to get oh Chanel gosh. trainers. So these are a fantastic. They're price. less than half price. Less than half. Price. Yeah, really, really good. Chanel trainers. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so comfy. But at eight hundred eighty, so it's expensive. just a bit like it's crazy. I, when you're in that kind of region, you almost like I, I think I'll just save up to buy a bag. Yeah, it's like yeah, a thousand yeah. pounds. Yeah, yeah. So this is a very good price. Yeah, so it's an, an excellent price. So all you need to do is just tap on that icon. They're available and it could be yours. So I'll let you choose one. Should we talk about this one? I love this one. I love this one. Again, love... This, is, this is so you. This is so me, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I think this is called the Bleecker bag. Bleecker as in named after New York's Bleecker Street. And it's crafted from Epi leather, and it's a tri-color. It is a tri-color. Yeah, tri-color. Yeah. Um, it's got like uh, the red, and it's got the light blue, light blue and navy, and this is Epi leather. I and think this is so it fashion is, forward. I, I know. It. To me, it's the sort of item where do, what, it can't even fit a phone, you but can't. I love it's a it. Statement, it is say. a statement, and it will look gorgeous in your room as an interior. Imagine yeah. on a um, on the bookshelf with lots of coffee books underneath. Beautiful. It is, but wait till you see inside. Oh my god, I haven't actually seen it. Yeah. Inside. Oh my gosh. It comes with its shoulder strap as well as Look mirror. At that mirror. I know wow. they are just so cute. I'd probably carry this as my everyday makeup bag. And yeah. it's, got the mirror, it's got the mirror in it as well. Yeah. No need and to carry anything. Exactly. Out the condition is excellent. And because it's crafted from epi leather, it's actually great, the Louis Vuitton um, first grain sure. proper leather. Yeah. So it's a grain leather. But the grain leather first came about, about in the 1930s. And back then it wasn't um, available to the public. It was a, a custom made leather for the Maharaja of Baroda. Oh, wow. Yeah, he wanted a, a tea caddy that was durable, yeah. um, could withstand travel. Yeah. And he wanted it for his elephant. Oh my God. So he would ride his elephant and have tea. What a fantastic I story. know. So if it's good enough for the Maharaja of Baroda, <laughs> it'll be good enough for us. <laughs> and it wasn't until I think later on in the, uh, much later, don't, could be like 60s or 70s, no, could be about 80s, where they actually produced this leather uh, for the public. So this is just absolutely gorgeous. So it's probably around about 15 centimeters across. So it's a tiny little vanity case bag. Would it fit a phone? I don't think, think it, it would. would. Do, Do you have, have your phone? phone? Okay, what, what size phone is yours, Vivian? Um, 11 Pro. This is an 11 Pro. Let's just see if that fits in. If you angle it, yes, oh, it, it does. does. So it if you does. angle it in a certain way, probably yeah. um, like this, on, on the diagonal, it does fit fine. So definitely um, would fit an iPro Phone 11. I didn't um, think it would, but that's yeah, really good. Yeah, really, does. really cute. So it comes with its uh, detachable strap, and I would personally wear it as a um, crossbody oh, style bag. That just looks so fancy. It, this, is so, this is so right, Sarah. It's this so is so fashion. me. It's so you. Oh, it well, is, we didn't even mention the details. Yeah, it's got a beautiful it's, 
LV it's detail. It's so beautiful on you. Yeah. And it's just a fun bag. It's one of those bags, if you go to a party, it's definitely a conversation piece. Absolutely. They're like, oh, where's your bag from? It's so cool. Imagine so, in the summer wearing all linen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Of colour. Yeah, beautiful. exactly. So, yes. Oh, and the strap has, it's, it's got ad adjustable buckles, so you can um, adjust accordingly. So this bag, uh, in excellent condition, which comes with a strap, as well as care booklets, it is available for £1,450, which is uh, $1,901. US dollars. Again, um, again that is such Very a great price. price. Um, and it's such a fun, you know, it's a unique piece. You're not going to get that anywhere else. And it's a great pre-owned item at a great price as well. <laughs> yeah. Someone asked what year. What year it is. Uh, I am not too sure. Let me just have a quick look. Yeah. Is it in the copy of the item? No. Can't see the... Let me give me one more... I think it's fairly new. I can't quite see the date stamp. Sometimes limited edition pieces don't date stamp. I would say within the last couple of seasons. I hope that helps. So it's fairly new. Within the past two years or even less. So it's not a vintage piece. <laughs> So let's move on to uh, other items. Shall um, we talk about the Chanel now? I think. Yes. I think they want to. You want? They want to see Chanel. Yeah. Let's Why don't we talk about this piece? Yes. Okay. We have not one, but two <laughs> vintage Chanels, ten inch, and they are chevron. We've got one in suede, and we've got one in lambskin. So let's start off with the suede. Um, anything suede, especially when it comes to Hermes and Chanel, they're actually quite rare and they're quite sought after. So Hermes um, suede is called Double, and normally the suede constants, it's something you can only see at auctions because, or specialist auctions, because they just do not come on the market. So where well, we've got this suede chevron vintage in black uh, available at Luxury Promise, this is quite an unusual piece. Uh, this is equivalent to a 10 inch medium size, um, features the 24 karat gold gilding, uh, as well as the movable chain. And I just think it's such a classic bag. I love this one. Yeah, and it's nice that um, it's chevron quilting. Uh, this is, I, I don't think, I've been here for maybe two years now, I don't think I've ever seen chevron no. in, in um, suede. suede. Yeah, exactly. I love the fact that it's chevron as well. Yeah, it. It's, it is a vintage piece, it is pre-owned, it comes with its card. Uh, it is the one series, so it's from 1989 to 91. Uh, the exterior does show light signs of wear. Just very, very minimal signs of wear. Um, but overall, I mean, this is a very rare piece. And like Sarah was saying, I don't, this is the first one we've had in two years. Yeah, I've, not, I've never seen one. suede one, yeah. And I love the 24 karat gold gilding yeah. against the suede. It yeah, just it just looks so brighter, chic, yeah. doesn't it? Yes. So... Um, do you want to try it on? Yes, so sure. this is a 10 inch medium size and definitely, and Asara is a, a five foot tall. And crossbody wise, yes. I think that will fit you fine. Yeah, perfect. Oh, it really, yeah, it looks good. It's cross another body. size for crossbody. Yeah, very, very cute. I will um, demonstrate it on myself. So uh, I am about five foot three. This over the shoulder is in very good condition. Just put my brooch back on. And I can definitely wear it as a crossbody bag, but it will be high cross on me, so just uh, below my chest. But it does feel very comfortable. Yeah. Um, I'll just show the condition one more time. It is uh, rated as good. It is vintage. It includes its serial sticker and card. It's from 1989 to 91. However, all the hardware is in excellent condition, which features the 24 karat gold gilding. There's no chipping or tarnish. And it's a double flat bag. And interior is nice and clean. And the price of this is only £3,995, uh, which is US dollars um, With the prices of vintage, the way they're going up in the last couple of months, I've not seen a vintage bag, vintage classic, for less than £4,000 yeah, now. Yeah. So that's an incredible price. So if you like the look of this bag and you want to see more information, 
There it is, the on icon is just there. You could just tap on that icon and it will take you to the website where you can see further images. Now, so that was the uh, suede. Let's do the lambskin. Yeah, so this is the lambskin leather version with the chevron quilting. And it also features the 24 karat gold gilding and the double chain as well. So this is also a vintage piece. It does show some signs of wear. But overall, there's no color transfer. There's no other major damage. All, all the hardware is in good working order. And this is the 10 inch medium size. It includes it's a double flat bag. It includes its original uh, dust bag here. And it has a nice clean interior and it has a serial sticker and this is a two, one series as well which is uh, from 1989 to 91. Which one do you for your personal wardrobe what one would you prefer? The suede or the lambskin? Uh, I don't know it's hard got a classic flap yeah. I would have gone the suede yeah. but because I have one in lambskin already I'd go for the suede yeah I think I'd go for the suede yeah the suede is just a bit more unusual yeah that's exactly yeah because right. no one else has that mm -hmm. no it's really hard to get a hold of suede so the price will be shortly revealed the lambskin is only oh three thousand five hundred that's good Really good, really price. good price, guys. Really Only good price. 3,500, which is 4,590 US dollars. It is just there. Oh, there it is. Three and a half thousand pounds is a very good price. Right? Yeah. A very, very good price. Because you, you have been uh, working as a weekend associate for a couple for two years yeah, now. And have you seen a Chanel bag no. for less than 4,000 pounds? <laughs> I'm like, hmm, it's a very good price. <laughs> it's Especially very good vintage. Good. So, yes. So if you want to see further information on this amazingly priced, competitively priced uh, chevron, lambskin, 10 inch, uh, classic double flat bag, uh, it is on the bottom icon. All you need to do is just tap on that icon. And guys, don't forget, we also cover your customs and duties. So let's move on. Let's actually, I want to do this bag. Because I know this is let's very, do that. yeah, this is very well priced. Yes. So we have this, um, I love this. I know. It's probably I, a bit too big for me, but I love it. Yeah. I really appreciate this. You, Sarah, you know, I, just, I got my first Kelly earlier this week. Did you? Yes. What, what colour did you I get? I got a vintage Rouge H Kelly 32 yes. in Epsom. Oh my God. Yeah, from, oh my God. Uh, it's vintage from 1990. Amazing. And it comes with a strap and everything. Congratulations, Winnie. <laughs> I know. Oh, you've been wanting one for ages. I know. <laughs> I, I wore it yesterday. I was very nervous. Really? It was like... Children do not come near me. Yeah. yeah. How do you feel? Do when you wear one, how do you feel? I feel like this. <laughs> no, <laughs> I don't want anyone to come near me. Yeah. But okay. I absolutely love it. I'm, I'm, it, it yeah. yeah. So when I saw this, I thought this is, and I saw the price. I won't tell you what the price is. Yeah. But this is an incredible price. Okay. This is the Kelly 40. So this is the Kelly, when it goes beyond 35, when it hits 40, it's known as the travel Kelly. Yeah. Yeah, because it's a... Um, it's, it's a good one. It's actually a really, imagine that walking through the airport. Yeah, exactly. It's, you know, the size of it is actually decent enough size to fit in your laptop. Yeah. So it's actually you, a really good work bag. In exactly, honesty, yeah. yeah. I think it's both a good work bag and a travel bag. Uh, I believe this is a colour of Rouge H because it looks very <coughs> similar to my or Rouge People. Can't remember. And uh, with the Palladium hardware, a size 40. It comes with, I think this is really nice. A uh, strap, you love the strap. Yeah, I love the strap. I mean, the strap alone is like eight hundred pounds on its own. I so really like yeah, it is really really nice. It is a pre-owned item, um, but however, it's been well looked after. It is nice and clean. There's no major wear along the back, and the handles are in good condition as well. So inside, the bag comes with. Uh, does it have a key and cross yet? Just have a quick look. Yes, it should have. Yeah, it should have. Okay, let me just check. Yes, it does. Yeah, I can see. It comes with the key and cross as well. 
Uh, no dust bag, but we'll provide you with a complimentary Luxury Promise dust bag. It's nice and clean, very, very roomy. And this is, is it Clement's leather on the copy? Or yes. Tobo, Clement's leather. And what's the name of this colour? Is, is it just say red. Red. I think this is Rouge H. Yeah. Rouge H is supposed to look like the heart. So really? if you think about it, it does look like yeah. the heart colour. It kind doesn't of it? does, in a weird way. <laughs> yeah. Let me just... Uh... So, uh, that's a great... Now, I know I love this colour as well. So I'll just for scale on me, it's five foot three. I think it's actually a very good work bag. It actually looks really nice with what you're wearing. Right yeah, well. it doesn't overwhelm me. I don't feel like I'm carrying a suitcase. Yeah. I think it's actually very comfortable. Let's see how it looks on you because you're sure. way more petite than me. How does it look, by the way? It looks good. It's does a it? good. It's a good work travel bag. Yeah. Yeah. I think any bit of really comfortable. Isn't yeah, because of the web, uh, the webbing on the, yeah. on the strap. I love this strap, by the way. I think it's, it's a really, really nice size. Yeah. Really comfortable on the shoulder as well. Yeah. What I've noticed now, actually, with this strap, it's it's um, two way yeah, color. Yeah. I saw that. So you can. I love the way the grey complements the the red. But if you wanted the red, you can also have the the red on the other side as well. So it's a contrasting two way color way. And we can reveal the price. This is only five thousand nine hundred and fifty. You're kidding! Is that a good price? That is five thousand nine hundred and fifty for a Kelly wow. forty, what which is, is seven thousand eight hundred and three. Let's. Two thousand and eleven. From two thousand and eleven. Yeah, it is. Shocking. I can see you thinking, Sarah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, I can hear wow. the clocks are turning. It's, it's a really good That time. is, I, I agree. This is, that's why I put that, that is for a Kelly, exactly what uh, Natalie was saying. Really to get really a pre-owned Kelly for less than £6,000 on this market it's is impossible. It's impossible. The cheapest we can offer is normally seven. And the quarter so, is Yeah, it is such a fantastic price. Barely any sign of use yeah, at all. Yeah. Wow, I'm really impressed by this one. Yes. I really like it, Winnie. So before grab it before Sarah <laughs> does. Literally. <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, click on that icon. It can take you to the website. You can see further information. Uh, Dipti, see, can we see the condition again? I can't believe my ears. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, can't I can't believe, believe my eyes. <laughs> sure, we'll show you one more time. Palladium hardware is very good with no wear, no scratches. Uh, the corners are generally in good condition. There's actually no major scuff marking at all. And the corners here as well, also very minimal wear. Uh, the front is lovely condition. You can see that beautiful shine. There are no scr scratches. No That's, sign of you. Yeah. yeah, no major, nothing major nothing, at all. Exactly. Nothing um, that stripes us that we need to point out. Uh, this, that's the beauty of Clements. It's very hard, hard wearing. Yeah. And there's definitely no um, scratches or wear to the back as well. And I'll just show you the handles. The handles show no cracking. It's in good, clean condition. The strap is immaculate. Yeah, the strap is excellent. Very durable. And comes with a cochet and keys and padlock. And yeah, I think it's a very... Oh, yeah. I would rate this as very good. Very good, yeah. yeah. Very, very good um, pre-owned piece. Hope that helps, Dip Team. And if you want to see more information on that, all you need to do is just uh, tap on that icon. That was, that was a good one, really. Yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, I see that we have hit uh, 50 people. I think more people have joined. Um, if you have just joined us via Instagram or you just come across us on the website, my name is Winnie and I'm joined by the lovely Sarah, our weekend associate. And in today's show, we are doing Sunday highlights. So things that are already available on our website. So just a recap as well as previous shows from my colleagues, Sade and Grace, we have a few for highlights from their shows, as well as a sneak peek. We've got a couple of items that hasn't been launched, it's only exclusively on this website, so you've got to stay on and um, watch us. Now, if you are shopping from outside the uh, UK, uh, we also cover all your customs and duties. 
uh, which is amazing because sometimes really customs good. duties for certain countries can be an extra 20%. So there's no hidden charges. We will cover that for you. It's included in the price. The only thing you have to pay is shipping. Shipping is £10 for the UK, uh, £15 for Europe and £35 for the rest of the world. We take all major forms of credit and debit uh, cards as well as PayPal. And we also offer Split It as well. Split It is an interest-free way to spread those um, luxury costs into bite-sized monthly three, tw six, 12 and nine months and most importantly it's interest-free there's no additional charges audit all I you do need to have is um, it's available only on credit cards and you need to have the full amount available when you check out and then it will be divided into those the, the monthly plans that you take hope that helps so <laughs> uh, so let's talk about this one. I yeah. think this one is a really good steal. Y yes. There you go. <laughs> yes. Um, we've actually sold quite a few Gucci marmots in the shop today, haven't yeah, we? we have. Yeah. So um, we've got this black version. This is in amazing condition. To me, it appears like it's never been used. used. That's what I thought. Yeah, never been used. Has that lovely brass go um, gold tone hardware with the Gigi marmont and has that cute little heart symbol on the back. And most importantly, the, back, the Marmont bag, it's almost like a camera size bag. I would say it's equivalent to nine inches across, so it's a good small size bag, and it has a movable chain. So you can wear this crossbody or doubled up as a shoulder bag, and it features a little pincer lock, which you just press underneath. And inside, the bag is lovely and clean. So it's a really, really good bag. Yeah, really nice. Yeah. Do you I, have a Marmont? I, I don't actually, mm. I don't. But yeah, I did have a look at this before putting yeah. it out and I do think it's completely unworn. Yeah, it's in great condition. Yeah, really It's a uh, crafted from a smooth um, uh, calf black leather and it has that lovely gold tone brass uh, hardware. Yeah. So that looks cute. Yeah, Over it's the... a very it's, it's a very practical day. Yeah, piece. yeah. And I think okay. it will completely go with a lot of that. Yeah, exactly. Oh, it looks cute, crossbody. Yeah, really very, nice. very cute as a crossbody star bag. Do you want to try it on? Yeah, I'll try it on. So I would personally wear this. Actually, looks quite good with what I'm wearing. This is yeah. how I would style this bag, and I would actually have this as my everyday errands bag. Yeah. Just you know, practical. Yeah, it's very practical. You go hands free. And it's it's got, you're right. It looks really nice. Yeah, right and it's a crossbody style. It's got that lovely suede interior, excellent. And it's big enough definitely to hold up to an iPro 13 Max Pro phone. Yep. Uh, your wallet, keys, makeup, um, all your sort of daily essentials that you need at close at hand. And I'll just show the condition one more time. It appears hardly used. Excellent condition, no scratches to the leather. The gold tone hardware is excellent, no tarnish, and the interior is nice and clean. And the price is £1,100 or 1442 US dollars. And the icon will just appear. There you go. And if you want to see further Im images and information on the bag, then you just need to tap on that icon. <laughs> uh, Sarah Jane says, uh, what store is Sarah based in? I love her attention to detail. <laughs> <laughs> London store. <laughs> <laughs> and she's uh, Sarah Jane's actually asking, where's your blazer from? This one is um, Claudie Pialot. Oh, I love it. It's actually it. on the street. Yeah, the street just opposite. Well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It gives me Chanel vibes. Yeah, that's why, that's why exactly. I love it. <laughs> oh, it's cute. Yeah. Uh, let's do. Uh, let's do the start of our sneak peek bag. And Can I you know, do my favourite one, please? Which one? This one or this one? The little one. The little one, okay. Nice. So, for those who have just stayed on for almost, how long? 45 minutes in, we'll do our first of our sneak heat bag. And I'll have to hand it to Sarah because <laughs> she was admiring it while oh, we were setting oh up. Gosh. Are you ready? Let's how adorable. Did you oh see this, Vivian? I think I'm this is the smallest little mirror. Look at this. <gasps> mirror and a little. <laughs> It's so cute. Oh, it is, it so, is cute. so adorable. I it love is it. the micro mini flat bag. Um, it is absolutely adorable. Features silver tone hardware. What I love about it, it actually has that little tiny, tiny. lipstick charm 
as well as a little mirror as I, well. Brinny, honestly, I think this is the cutest so piece cute. I've seen. Yeah. Everyone's going crazy. <laughs> and lots of lights. I can see lots of hearts it's going. So it is nice. So cute. Look at it. Just seriously look at this. So oh cute. My God. The, t the you can actually have the handle like that. Yeah, however. I saw it like this. It yeah. Like yeah. Would you wear it like a little hand? I'd buy this for my daughter. <laughs> I'd buy this for my daughter. That's a very uh, bijou daughter. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> however, it does have a longer chain. It does well. have a longer chain. So how Sarah um, uh, uh, styled it, she just tucked in the chain. And made it shorter but this bag actually features a really long crossbody style chain so if you find that the chain you, is actually long enough yeah. to wear as a crossbody style bag that is so cute. cute it super is so so cute, cute. the um, length on this one just to gauge how tiny it is if you don't mind holding that yeah, I'll just get my measuring tape out it is a little micro bag. So it is equivalent to uh, about five, five and a half inches wide, which is roughly 15 centimetres. So it's a really, really tiny bag. It probably won't fit a phone. Yeah. Maybe an iPhone 8 and older. Should we try it? Okay. I've got an iPhone 10. Should we try oh, it? Oh, sorry, an iPhone 11, isn't it? I, I yeah. doubt it, but let's try, try it. Let's try yeah, it. let's try. Let's give it a go. Uh, no, I no. don't think so. Yeah, I don't want to. Does it? No. No. No, it won't. I don't want it like. Yeah. So it features. Um, it's a single flat bag. It's crafted from nylon, and it fit, features the choco bar um, uh, quilting. Comes with its original sti serial sticker. It is yeah. what series? A nine series. Uh, what year is that? Oh, nine series. That must be 2005 or 6. Nine, nine. Yeah, nine series, you know. 2004, 2005. Yeah, so 2004 to 2005. So definitely more than 15 years old. Yeah. And it is just so adorable. It comes with its dust bag as well. A little Chanel dust bag as well. It is Love really, really cute. It is so... It's a definitely a collector's piece. Yeah, it? definitely. Beautiful. I agree. And yeah. it is... Equip I think this is actually, you know, I know the modern heart Chanel's are going crazy right now because you know Chanel just yeah they've yeah. got the heart one yeah I think this is much nicer yeah mm. I this do. this I will do. definitely uh, be uh, worth the investment because I when I when when I was pricing this I don't think I was able to see anything on the market right now yeah for from this season from two thousand this is from two thousand four two thousand five so all the hardware is in excellent condition. Um, it's all uh, and the main satin exterior is nice and clean with no wear. It is satin, however, the lining is leather. The hardware is excellent, no wear to the corners, and it features the chocolate choc chocolate bar um, quilting because it looks like chocolate bar. Mm -hmm. Love that. The hardware is excellent, and. It is so cute. So the price of this bag is three thousand five hundred pounds, which is four thousand five hundred and ninety US dollars. That's an incredible price. Mm -hmm. So um, it's available now, and um, if you love this bag, and I definitely think this is a good investment collector's piece for future, um, definitely um, click on that icon, and you can see further information on that bag. Right so let yeah, me show one more Chanel. Let me do a vintage. Maybe after vintage, we'll do that one. Yeah, I, I was going to say, yeah, yeah, love that. So, I've got a really lovely vintage Chanel Peyton bag, and this is incredibly priced. So, if you are jumping onto this show for the first time and you love vintage and you want something that's affordable, and that's how I got into vintage because um, I could never afford it brand new in the store, mm -hmm. so it has to, you know, I thought I need to, you know. Vintage was the best way to go. This is a great starter investment bag. It features the Peyton leather, which is overall in great condition. It doesn't feel sticky. Um, it's almost like a, um, what do you call it, a dome style bag. And it's actually a really good medium size over the shoulder bag. Really nice. Yeah, it's very, very uh, ladylike, I think. Yeah. yeah. Features the Chanel hardware and gold tone um, gilding along the 24, which is 24 karat gold gilding. 
and overall it's in good condition. Uh, there is one little minor wear here. There's a scuff mark, visible scuff mark here. But apart from that, nowhere else. The corners are good. And I just love that CC. Yeah, so, so cool. cute, right? Beautiful. So, so cute. The bag uh, is nice and clean inside and it comes with its original cereal sticker, cereal sticker only. All the hardware is intact, it's in good working condition. And I think this is a, th is it a three or a four series? It's, it's a four series. Four series. 96 right. to 97. So it's from 96 to 97. So Chanel Vintage, the best period, is definitely from the 90s. It's a fixed length strap and ideally worn over the shoulder. Yeah. And it's a good size bag. Definitely could, I don't think it'd fit a laptop, but definitely fit. An iPad. Yeah, an iPad, a phone, keys, yeah. wallet, all your daily essential, even a book. Oh, definitely, yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Even maybe a bottle of water. I think so. Yeah, because it's deep enough. It is deep. I yeah. always carry a bottle of water, so uh, always that's for me. Sometimes it's the water bottle test. Yeah. So I'm five foot three, and uh, Sarah is a five foot, and it's beautifully on yeah. you. It doesn't like overwhelm no, you. No, it doesn't, and it sits really comfortably. Yeah. Without it feeling too heavy. Yeah, yeah. Really nice. That it's sits really nice, nice as well. Yeah. So. And I just want to show that lovely Chanel logo. Love that detailing, it's yeah. So, so cool. Pretty. Yeah. I think to me this bag is discreetly says it's Chanel. Without it being discreetly. Yeah, For yeah. Sure. So um, if you're wearing this and other people check you out, you know you know that you know. Yeah. <laughs> it's no, vintage. It's, it's if you know, you know. You know, know. exactly, yeah. <laughs> exactly. So the price will be revealed I shortly. Really like that. Yeah. Oh, it is £1,495, which is US dollars And all you need to do really is... Really good to, price. Yeah, it is a brilliant really good price. price. Yeah. To get a vintage Chanel bag, um, even beat up ones mm -hmm. are like £1,800 exactly. on our website. So this is like £300 below what we normally charge. Yeah. So this is £1,495, which is US dollars And all you need to do is just tap on that icon and you can add to cart and check out further information and images. Let's do the mock croc bag. Let's do that. Yes. I love this. Why do you love this bag? I don't know, I just think it's really, I just think it's really fun. Yeah. It's such a fun bag. I know, it is gorgeous. I had this on my boho show about a week ago and it was one of my favourite pieces. Yeah, I just think it's really, I do think it's quite unique. Yeah. Um, it, does it retail? Uh, I think it does, not now, but I think it's only like one or two years old. Yeah, so. I've, since being here I've seen one in silver with the gold hardware and now this one. Yeah. They don't come about often. Especially on the yeah. pre-owned market. Yeah. Because when uh, YSL does release them, they're only on limited editions. So we very rarely get them on the pre-owned market. Um, and especially, I think it's so on trend right now with everybody's doing heart-shaped bags. Everyone. And yeah. also I just think that this would look so nice with just, if you're wearing just blue jeans and a white shirt, this is all you need. Yeah. It, you it don't just, need to overdo no, it. No, no, exactly. And it's actually quite roomy, this bag. It's it may so seem like a uh, Complete bolt. with its Can original you... dust bag and authenticity card and immaculate condition inside. Yeah. And, and this, yeah, you can fit yeah, quite a lot Yeah, this is an there. iPro Phone 11 and definitely fits in fine. And it can even go uh, uh, accommodate a bigger phone, like yeah, a 13. I think so. And yeah. then still plenty of room to put more items, items in. Yeah. So. Definitely. Yeah, do you like this, Winnie? Would you I like love it. Yeah? Yeah, I love would it. You, would you hold it? Or I would, would you? I would do like it's that. Cool. Yeah. It to me, nice well. what I love, it's not only the shape, I love the tassel. Yeah, me too. Because um, it's quite, um, what's the word? Chinoiserie? Very Chinese. Yeah, it is. Which, yeah, yeah, which uh, YSL loved. He really embraced um, lots of different cultures. Um, remember the perfume opium? Yes, that has a very dark noir, chinoiserie feel yeah. to it. So I think that sort of plays homage to that kind of um, design philosophy of YSL. 
So yeah, and I just love the way the handle is looped inside. And I must take out the phone before I forget the video. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise somebody might get a, a free phone. <laughs> it's a really cute evening bag yeah. well, because of that dress. Exactly, yeah. it's just so chic. But do you think you can wear it out and about? I think so. Yeah, like I'm just wearing jeans and a shirt. Yeah. You is it all right like this? I think definitely. Yeah. The Chanel little ones, everyone's rocking the little Chanel ones as yeah. an accessory bag. But this is such, such a, a cute more, bag. And it's a more affordable in comparison to, to Chanel. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. 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 And um, it's just, I think it's a great conversation piece. So I if do. you're going out for it's dinner with friends, they'll be like, what? From. So the price of this heart loop bag is £1,100, which is US dollars It's in great condition. Um, it's been really well looked after. There's no scratches to it. And all the gilding and everything is in excellent condition. Comes with yeah. its dust bag as well as authenticity yeah. card. And yeah, and it could be yours if you're interested. For £1,100. Yeah. That's really good. So tap on that icon. <laughs> I think the wallets are like five or six hundred now. Yeah. Just the basic. Basic little, on yeah, there. exactly. So, you know, slightly double more, you get a really unique bag. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Love that. So, love that too. Uh, let's do some fun, affordable bits. We've got, this is a nice, well-priced item. That's beautiful. This is the Fendi Oyster bag. And this is a vintage Fendi. I, you could tell, I love leopard print. <laughs> You do, you do. I remember Sabrina once asked, do you wear print, like leopard print? And I was wearing full-on, like, leopard print. leopard print. And she's like, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> my sister, my sister Yasmin, she's obsessed with le leopard print. I love all pet leopard she, print. She, honestly, she, she loves it. She'd like this. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I probably look like, do you remember, is it, uh, who's that lady uh, who's in Coronation Street? Oh, this is a really old TV show now. Anyway, she would um, wear Bet Lynch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pulling pipes behind the bar. Yeah, I went for long with Bet Lynch, yeah. <laughs> so this is a nylon, cra oh, actually canvas crafted Fendi, vintage Fendi. And it features the um, leopard print, which we both love. Actually, I'll let you model. I used to work as a textile designer. And one of our uh, bread and butter prints, the prints that always like, always need to feature when we're designing prints is a leopard print mm -hmm. because a leopard print um the colorways are usually just two or three colors and it goes with everything it actually does yeah, yeah. and it's a non-seasonal color yeah so you can wear it in the winter summer like you know 12, 12 months of the year yeah so it's a to us in the a textile print world a, a leopard print we call it the non-print print was a good staple so yes this is in lovely condition and actually, if you um, see discreetly inside one of the leopard print designs, it actually has the Fendi logo. Oh, how cool. I didn't even notice yeah, that. Yeah, it's Super so cute, cute. isn't Super it? Cute. It is really, really cute. So cute. It's yeah, very cute. isn't it so cute? cute? And I just love the way that it's just a little pouch style yeah, bag. Yeah, very comfortable. Very, very comfortable. So how would you wear this, Vivian? Would you, what, how would you style it? I would do like blue distress jeans with white like baby craft tee with that for that Kendall Jenner album. yes <laughs> yes really the Gen Z yeah. knows how to <laughs> to uh, yeah definitely style so um, and over it's got adjustable strap so it's on the longest setting right now so for for both me and Sarah it's definitely the perfect as the yeah. over the shoulder bag but if you want it a bit tighter depending on your height you can definitely uh, do that as well now I won't show you the price <laughs> tell it, me it's 245 no. pounds oh isn't that God. a great price for a Fendi piece as well yeah 245 pounds really nice. for a vintage 90s Fendi with the unique leopard print it is an incredible yeah, price really good price and um, um, really spacious on the inside, I've just realised. Yeah. Is it nice and clean inside? We've got to show actually. Yeah, no, it's. Look how clean it is. Oh, it's immaculate. amazing. It's immaculate. The features the Fendi logo inside. It has just appeared. Um, on our screen, it looks like there's no images, but if you click on it, it should take you to the website and show you the images. Yeah, this is yeah. such a good practical piece. And only £245, which is uh, 321 US dollars. Really yeah. good price. That is a really, really good price. I mean, you buy high street bags now. Definitely. For 
in the £200 range. Absolutely, like, yeah. a, like a Zara bag is like £100. Yeah, exactly, like yeah, yeah, definitely. So, overall, in great condition. So, there. Uh, what other bags shall we do? Or should we do some jewellery? Yeah, or we think we haven't spoken about oh, Louis Vuitton, yeah. actually. Have we done any? No, we haven't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do some Louis Vuitton, yeah. apart from the bleaker bag, this oh, yeah. is a great yeah. uh, Louis Vuitton bag, and this I is think, nice. let me just quickly check the name of this item, oh it doesn't show, it is uh, AW, ADL1620, whoops, what's the name, is it called Ava, or Eva, ADL1620, Two way Eva. Yeah, Eva. Okay. The reason why I said, because I think early on, the lady who said she bought her first designer bag was an Eva bag from Bermuda. Bermuda. I hope you're still on. I'm sorry, <laughs> I've forgotten your name. But guess what? Actually, in tonight's show, in today's show, we've got your very first exactly. bag. And we also have a follower here, which um, she talked about her very first designer bag she bought in Bermuda at uh, LV. Oh, Nilsa! Eva bag. <laughs> did she get the Damier as well? Did, did you get the Damier version or did you get the uh, monogram version, Nilsa? And do you still have it? Do you still use it? Let us know, no, Nilsa. So we actually have the two-way Eva bag. It's just coincidental that was... That it really we, yeah, is, yeah. I chose yeah. this for the show. Um, this one's in great condition. Gorgeous. Oh, she got it in Damier. Oh, oh nice. amazing. <laughs> so this is the Ibean colorway. And it's in great condition. It's in really well uh, looked after really condition. Well the hardware is excellent. It features a lobster clasp for one end, so it's detachable. Has that nice gold plating on there. Lovely and clean. And um, it is nice and clean inside as well. So it appears like it's been lightly used and well looked after. It's equivalent to about um, 10 inches across, so it's quite wide, but it's it's... Uh, the height is uh, much smaller. However, you can definitely put the latest phone, Android phone, as well as wallet and keys, and all your essentials. Now, this bag features, comes with its bonus strap as well. So well, let's put that on yeah. there. So you can wear it two ways. Make it day to evening. Yeah, definitely. So it features two straps, so you can wear it like this, over the shoulder. So you can put it over in the, in the crook of your arm, or you can wear it as a crossbody style bag as well, which is really brilliant. Cool. Yeah. Really cool. Really, really cool. So lots and of comfortable. Yeah, as in terms of the bag, this is definitely very practical, very durable, cost per wear. I think it's going to be a very good investment. Do you yeah. want to try it on? Yeah, of course. For size, I'm five foot three, and Sarah is uh, five foot tall. Looks great on really like nice. that. Yeah. Perfect, like imagine just wearing just a black dress yeah. in the evening. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And then, I mean, this is personally a little bit long. Yeah, right? too long for you. But yeah. So the price of this is only £995, which is 1,304 US dollars. I think that's a great price really good. for a near new Eva bag with a two-way option. And, um, and remember, if you're shopping from outside the UK, we do take care of your customs and duties. So um, the price you see is the price you pay. The only thing you have to pay extra is uh, co um, the cost of shipping, uh, which is £10 for UK and Europe's 15 and overseas is £35. That's great. Yeah. So, let's do some jewellery. Yeah, let's do jewellery. Okay, let's feature, let's feature these earrings. We've got two turnstile lock earrings. So um, let me take out my earrings, actually. We've got two. We've got, uh, first of all, I'll just show the gold. Uh, we've got everyone loves vintage Chanel jewellery. These gold ones are my personal favourites. These are good. I've got a pair of these, and these are just good for everyday wear. So if you're a fan of vintage Chanel jewellery and you love that iconic uh, CC lock, if you can see, this is a gold pair, and this is the smaller size uh, turnstile lock. It's equivalent to probably about two centimeters across and two centimeters high. And you can put on one, on yeah. One. They are a clip-on backing, and the hardware is excellent. 
and um, there is uh, it's signed 96A, so from 1996. And Sarah's got them on. Ah, oh, they're actually gonna leave. Thank you. Shall I give you a booster? <laughs> you can stand on my back. <laughs> I love these. They are, and how do they feel, Sarah? Super comfortable. Yeah, they're Very not. Nice. Yeah. So I mean, nice. do you wear clip on earrings? I have a Chanel vintage pair. And oh, do you? These are lighter than my other ones. Oh, really? So you feel like um, it doesn't hurt too much? Mm -mm. Yeah, and these are on me. Yeah. Just excuse my sideburns. <laughs> We're all working women here. So, um, but otherwise, to scale, I think they are a nice, discreet um, size. They are, yeah. Yeah. And they are um, in excellent condition. Really good condition. Yeah. We have no wear to them. And I just love that CC turnstile lock. And they are only £995, which is uh, uh, US dollars And they will shortly appear. The icon will shortly appear. And they are just there. Now, we feature, when it comes to vintage Chanel jewellery, a lot of the times it's gold. Uh, however, it's very uh, rare that we come across silver. And for those who prefer silver, we haven't left you out. We also have the same size CC turnstile lock in silver. And I very rarely come across I, silver. I, when I saw them, yeah, I was surprised as well. Yeah, I we very, you know, yeah, in we, silver in a while. exactly. They often don't aren't come on the market. And I think it's important because not everyone loves gold. Exactly, exactly. Yeah, so this is a silver pair with the clip-on backing. It's got a little comfort strap here, a comfort pad here, which you can buy from like Amazon if you wanted that extra padding. It is signed uh, Chanel and it's from the 97 collection, I think. 97? Oh, sorry, 96 a P spring collection. If you put one on. Yep. It's the same spec as the gold pair. It is roughly two centimeters by two centimeters. The hardware is excellent with no chipping. And I will just put that on just now. And they feel really comfortable on. Yeah. Especially with that pad thing. Yeah. Really nice. Yeah. Yeah, they look incredible on you. They look really, really good. Really like them. Yeah. And the price will be shortly revealed. It is also £995, which is uh, US dollars. So I will just show the comparison if you can't decide what one to get. Um, I will put on the, the silver pair. Oh, if you, should I put the gold on? Yeah, uh, have you got silver on? Got Keep silver. the silver on, I'm going to put the gold on. So Sarah will put on the gold, uh, silver, and I'll put on the gold, and then you can just see which colour suits you. So this is gold on me, and that is silver on Sarah. And they're both actually, they're both equally as nice. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. and they were quite a good um, discreet everyday wear. Yeah, and sometimes um, big uh, vintage Chanel jewel um, earrings can be really big, really big. Yeah, which, so these are like, like tiny. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. So these are good really discreet nice. everyday wear type of items. So yeah, do the um, gold CC turn out earrings come with a box? No, they don't come with a Chanel box, but we will provide you with a complimentary luxury uh, box and dust bag. So. And then we have one other item. This is so pretty. So I love vintage Chanel jewellery. We have this um, CC fixed bangle. Um, I know, it's gorgeous. This is really beautiful. This is, this is very me. This is a uh, Chanel vintage bangle and it's just surrounded by all the interlocking CC logos. That's so you when you wear the way. Yeah, yeah. Can you show them in comparison to the 3M size? I can't, uh, give me one moment. I won't be able to grab the three centimeter size because the stock room is in a different location. However, if I show you what three centimeters look like on here and then we'll grab. If you hold that, I'll mm -hmm. file this tape measure. At least the lady can see. So this is three centimeters across and this is two, yeah. So I hope you can see three centimeters is slightly bigger. I would say it's more of a, a statement size um, earring. I hope that helps. Actually, maybe I've got this on me. Uh, I'm just. 
Ah, this will help. So happens, I've got my brooch in my pocket. This is three centimeters. This is a brooch, and it's not for sale, guys. If anyone asks, <laughs> it's Winnie. <laughs> it's mine. So this is three centimeters, and this is two centimeters. Charlotte. Now that makes a uh, incredible. That makes a good visual um, scale for you. There you go. Right. Let's get back to this. Um, the bangle. This is a beautiful bangle, um, gilded in twenty-four karat gold gilding. It has a uh, little lock clasp, a fixed clock clasp, and it's on a, like a spring, um, which is quite nice actually. It gives it more security. A spring mechanism clasp, and you can put that over there, and then you put the little lock over the top, so it becomes very secure. And this one is in great condition. It has the same twenty-four karat gold gilding. And I just love all those tiny little CCs. Really nice. Really yeah, that is really, really cute. Uh, this piece is a it's signed uh, collection. It's from 1995. 90, 95. Do you want to try that on? Yeah. Yeah. And do you know what your wrist size is? Mm, no. Uh, okay, so. Is it I, usually in like centimeters? Yeah. Do you know what your watch size is? Uh, no, but these are 17. 17. So I'm normally a 16, I'd say. Yeah. Yeah. So, so um, Sara is normally 16 centimetres, so your bangles are 16 centimetres. These, no, these are 17 and they're big. Okay, yeah. so this one would be equivalent to 17 then. I'd say so. Yeah, this would yeah. be 17 centimetres across. But I have like tiny little wrists. <laughs> <laughs> Everything about you is pint tiny. size. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really nice. Yeah, yeah. It's in great condition. And the price will be coming up shortly. So the bangle is £1,600, which is an incredible price actually, because that yeah. could go into the 18 to £2,000 on the resale market, uh, or US dollars yeah. Oh, thank you, Sandy. I'm glad you like my brooch. Where is it? <laughs> yeah, that's why, because I, I always get compliments on it. It's a beautiful brooch. <laughs> You need the matching earrings. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I, I actually never wear them together. I don't yeah, know it I might be too much. Yeah, I don't know if I look like a, a Chanel sales girl. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah. Right, let's move on to, um, let's do a, ah, this one, this is, this is nice and affordable. Yes. Yeah. So we've got, uh, let's do some Prada. So this item comes with its original box. And this makes a great gift item. Mm -hmm. It's in lovely condition. And it is a Safiano limited edition little pouch. Um, and this is a great size pouch. You can wear it as a clutch. Features silver tone hardware. Has a, a little logo of, it looks like a gentleman. It looks like a, a porter carrying some suitcases. This is in great condition. I think this is definitely a unisex piece. Yeah, definitely. Um, and it's like a, a little portfolio pouch, definitely could fit your latest iPhone, and it has integrated card section, so you can I even use this as a wallet, yeah. because the way they've got the little cards inside. And yeah, I would say it's a good unisex piece, I'd right? I'd say so, yeah. You, even for travel, you can put your passport in there, all your travel... Cards, all of that. Yeah, all stuff. your travel documents, your COVID pass, all that kind of stuff when you go travelling. This would be an ideal gift as well. And because it's black with silver tone hardware, it's a great unisex item, like Sarah and was especially saying. especially with the little porter being... Yeah, yeah, it's very, very cute. It is cute. So, you can, yeah, you can wear it as a clutch, pop it inside another travelling bag, keep all your documents, all your important information, anything you need urgently by a side, you can put inside this pouch. So yeah. And this item is only £150. Wow. That's a great, yeah. great gift item, really guys. Really good, and considering it's in very good condition as yeah, well. Yeah, and it comes the with box its, is immaculate. Yeah. And it comes with its box, so it makes a great gift. And the item has just appeared. It doesn't look like the image is on my screen. However, if you click on the item, it should take you to the website and you should see further images online. Really nice. Thank you. So another pull back, the thing about the beauty of Prada is they are great unisex items. They're also very good travel items. 
like this. I think this is really cool. This is a little Prada bum bag. And you could, um, it's in great condition, crafted from nylon, has that silver tone. Hardware. Is this a vintage piece? Because um, it looks quite current. I think it's current because it has its little mm. card still. So it's probably only a few seasons old. Um, and it has adjustable um, waistband. But you could wear this as a crossbody style bag, right? As like a sling bag. Let's try it. Let's try it. Could you do that? Yeah, yeah as a high actually. cross. Yeah, yeah, I've seen people wearing yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah, cool people, not me. <laughs> <laughs> not middle-aged women like me. But yeah, it's crafted from nylon. It's in great condition. I really like this. It's cute, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So... Should I try yeah, it? Yeah, try it. Try yeah. How did you do it like, like that? that? Yeah. Is that how you say it? Yeah, it yeah. looks cute on you. I think it's quite cool. Yeah. And let me put it around your waist. Yeah. So people see. If you paired it up with like a black coat, like one of those nylon puffer yes. coats. Yes. It looked like a Prada. Yes. The nylon So you coat. wear it over a, a jacket. An over one. Can you yeah. imagine yeah. It's more of a winter look. But yeah, but it's still really cool. cool. Yeah. And it'd be more practical because you can easily access um, your bag. Oh yeah, definitely. And you could it would pass as one of the Prada coats as well. Yeah. That's what they do. Because you're so tiny, uh, it will be <laughs> loose on you. So I'll just It actually feels fine. Yeah? It's fine, yeah. That's because I'm holding it. Oh. <laughs> it might when, when I let go it will drop slightly on your hips. Okay. Yeah. That's so fine. yeah, it's cute. Fine. Very, very cute. Yeah. yeah. Very practical. Very well. practical. So great. handy to get into. Yeah, I mean, this would be a great travel bag. If you're going so. through airport security, yeah. you've got your passport, you've got your all your documents, you've got your currency in there, keep everything close yeah. to hand. Coachella bag. Yes. yes. Natalie exactly. said, um, Natalie is actually going to her first music festival. Oh, Natalie yeah. needs this bag. Then. Yeah, and she said, this will be the best festival bag. It is Natalie, so true. Yeah. Definitely can put your um, things you need at a festival. Baby wipes. <laughs> yeah, you can put that in here. Uh, what else? Um, your wallet, your keys, lipstick. Uh, what else could you put? Could you think you could put a water bottle? Mm. Maybe a small water bottle Maybe. in there. Yeah. The luxury promise ones. Could be. <laughs> we haven't got any. You know, we've sold out of those. Oh, have we? Oh, we've got oh, some shit. Yeah, I we're waiting we on the shipment. Yeah, we, we could have put yeah. them in there. Definitely. <laughs> great Disney bag. Oh. Yeah. Great. What does that mean by Disney bag? Like Disneyland? Have you got a Disneyland? Oh, Land? yes. That is yes. so true. And if you're with kids, it's definitely got loads of compartments to put snacks in, like mm -hmm. crackers, sweets, candy, while we're in the queue, where they're like, I'm hungry. The only thing you can't fit is a potty, where they need to go <laughs> toilet when you're five minutes away. Yeah. You're like, no, you just got to hold it in. We're going to get on the ride. <laughs> this is really nice. So this little um, pouch bag is only four hundred ninety-five pounds, which is six hundred and forty-nine US dollars, and um, it's just appeared. If you click on that, oh, something has just sold. I'm not too sure what. If Vivian would tell us, and all you need to do is just tap on that icon, and it could be yours. Make like like Thane said, it is. They, I think it's Thaney. Thaney just said. It makes a great mum Disney line um, bag. Yeah. <laughs> Looks just there. Amazing. So we've got should one. We, should we stick it to Prada and show yeah, it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, you were going to show yeah. it. Oh, no, no, let's do this one. Okay. I'm not sure what. That's all. Okay, no problem. Another nylon. Piece. Yeah, we've got another great nylon bag. This, I think, is uh, was only just last season. And this is a really fun padded, it reminds me of, you know when, it was the season where they did all those massive yeah. padded jackets yeah. with a tiny little belt. Yeah. So it came from that season. Uh, this is in great condition. It's got the nylon padding. It's almost like a bowling bag. Yeah. And it has a contrasting black and red leather top handle. Yeah. And it comes with detachable straps as well. So it makes a great uh, over the shoulder bag. This also makes a great travel bag, actually. Yeah, I think so. Because yeah. it's like, so handy with all the different compartments. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's in very good condition. Very, well. very good condition. So, just show you. It appears to be like it's never been used. 
The handles are great. The shoulder straps are great condition. And inside, oh wow. A lot of room. Lovely. It's really, it looks like near new. And it's got a lovely contrasting red lining inside. Lovely and clean. Bag. And it has a little crossbody style shoulder strap as well. What size would it fit up to, Winnie? Uh, the waist for this, bag, I think. The waist bag, yeah, sure. Let me just show you the waist bag. Uh, I would put it around me. I'm a UK 12, and I think I have a 32-inch waist. To do it for you, Winnie? Yes, please. Actually, would it work yeah, over... Maybe let's do this whole thing like everyone wears over their <laughs> Yeah, let's do that. Let's try it out. Yeah, this... Like, you don't mind? No, of course not. I shouldn't have... Eating that bowl of pasta. Don't <laughs> 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 you've got plenty of room. Oh, that's good. Does that feel comfortable? Yeah, very comfortable. I, I like it because it feels like a girdle. Yeah. <laughs> it like better than a Spanx, guys. This is a way more useful than a Spanx bag. So this, I'm nice, a, isn't it? yeah, I'm a UK twelve, about a thirty-two inch waist. So and it feels comfortable. And is there enough room? There's yeah, still, there's yeah, more, yeah, there's, there's more, more room. There's more uh, yeah, there's to cinch holes. It. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so you can cinch it. So definitely up to a UK twelve or a US eight. Um, even go further. I think you even fit a UK fourteen. Yeah, I think so because you've got two more holes. If if you wanted to make it way looser. Yeah. So I think so. Yeah, so that a US, so UK 14 would be a US 10. So definitely generous in sizing. Yeah, it's actually really cute. It's really cute. Look at, look at that. Yeah. Really cool. Very practical. I've got to, uh, um, it's my um, Easter holidays. My son's on half term. Yeah. And we're going away to Portugal. This would be a really good. Uh, really good. Yeah. <laughs> Keep everyone's passports in here. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, cute. Like so, it. So, yeah. I know it's such a versatile bag, Denise. Yeah, it does look cute with the blazer. It does. It really does. I think yeah. so. Yeah. And all you need to do is just tap on that icon if you want to see further information on that bag. So the... Uh, have we revealed the price of this one? No, yeah. Do you want okay. to? Yes, please. So we were just reviewing this other travel bag. This is uh, £695, which is 911 US dollars. This also makes a great uh, a weekend away gym bag, travel bag. Um, it's very compact and very durable, and it has like one, two, three, four pockets, as well as the main central pocket and detachable shoulder straps yeah. as, well, as well. So just tap on that icon. Uh, before we finish up on Prada, the last Prada item we have is this vintage khaki backpack. So we all love, uh, let me just put some stuff in there so you can see the size. So this is a vintage khaki uh, nylon backpack. It's got that lovely khaki colour green, sort of brownie green, almost army green colourway. Um, it is a vintage piece. It does have some colour discoloration here along the sides. But the main sort of leather trims are excellent. Has silver hardware, adjustable straps. Nice clean along the back and um, and this is the larger size backpack with the two front pockets and I think it makes a really good school bag yeah college I bag so. work bag yeah both men and women unisex teenagers if they deserve it if they pass their a-levels <laughs> <laughs> they get through their a-levels yeah. um, and I know that this is a very good price point as well I'll just put this on Sarah who's uh, a petite five foot tall and how does it feel on you? It doesn't engulf you, does it? Not at all. Yeah. It feels very comfortable in that. Yeah. It sits really nicely. Yeah. Looks good. Yeah. Did you ever have a backpack at school? No. I didn't think you were a backpack no. girl. We used to have those, like, do you remember those uh, inflatable bubble? Did you? It, you probably won't. It was yeah. more probably my generation. It was like you would get it from like these gadget shops and you would like inflate it. And it was just like, it was like, we didn't care about designer back then. Do you know what I'm talking about? Mm -mm. No. Oh. Is this like in the year Does 2050? Anyone, what? Was, <laughs> maybe, maybe, I don't know. Maybe if you guys remember those bags, did, they were like... Did it like carry everything? Your it carried, yeah, everything. And it was really cool. It was almost like you would get, and it was a thing. Like you could get like one of these chairs that was also 
like you could inflate it. I don't know if it, <laughs> is it, was it only me? I hope yeah. you guys know what I'm talking about. Was, <laughs> but we did not care about Prada back then, but no. now I reckon if it was my sort of like generation, yeah. I would be dying yeah, for yeah, Prada bag. Yeah, exactly. I would make my mum buy, buy yeah, me exactly. a Prada backpack. And actually, I think Prada backpacks are really, really durable. They are, the reason being because the nylon, when it was first uh, incorporated in design, was actually came from military. Yes. Military grade. It's the same nylons that the uh, Italian army use, mm -hmm. especially for their tents. Oh, okay. So if it's good enough for the army, it's good, good enough, enough for us. you, for us civilians. So, yeah. Oh, Roxana said she had she, one of the. She had one? See? Yeah, it's I had one of the. Thing. Yeah. Oh, gosh. It's a real thing. So oh, you? yeah. Somebody said, I remember I had a kicker's bag. I remember at school, kicker's like. Kick, people were wearing kickers to school. Yes, they were exactly. like the bee's knees. They were super, yes, super, super cool. Uh, as well, another cool sc uh, school bag was Benetton. Everyone had Benetton mm -hmm. in my year. Everyone had Benetton <laughs> duffel bag. So yeah, yeah, how fun. <laughs> Yeah, Natalie even remembers. So this backpack is only two hundred and ninety-five pounds. Mm. That good is price. an incredible price, really good price because at retail these are well over a thousand pounds for nylon. So this is only two hundred ninety-five pounds, which is three hundred and eighty-six US dollars, and it's available to purchase. All you need to do is just tap on that icon. So you like that? Yeah, very much nice. so. I can see lots of people have just jumped on again. Let me introduce myself. I am Winnie and I'm joined by the lovely Sarah. So I am the commercial director at Luxury Promise and Sarah is our weekend sales associate. And today in this Sunday live show, we're, doing, we're bringing you the highlights from our website. So things that are available currently on our website, as well as a sneak peek of um, that not yet to hit the website, available only during this live show. So um, yes, yeah, so it's gonna be quite exciting. So how it works is that uh, we will be, this is all live, unedited, we'll be showing you the condition, we'll give you styling tips. Um, it's very much an interactive show. We've got these lovely community here. Say hi, ask some questions, ask us questions if you wanna see your bag, um, or our opinions of bags. We love um, to get, you know, you need to get interactive with us, that's how it works. As we're showing all these items, the product card will appear, you can see for example, one, two, three, as well as the price will be revealed and if you like those items and you want to purchase immediately all you need to do is just tap on those product cards those product icons and you can see go straight to our website you can see the product information um, as well as extra pictures and most importantly you just add to cart it is as simple as that so if you are shopping from outside the UK we're also covering your customs and duties so there are no extra taxes on top so the final price is the price you see. The only thing you have to pay a surcharge on is shipping, which uh, is £10 for UK, uh, Europe's £15 and £25, uh, £35 for the rest of the world. And we take all major forms of credit and debit to, um, um, cards as well as PayPal and as well as split it, which is an affordable way to spread all those um, uh, luxury purchases into uh, interest free over three, six, nine and 12 months. It's only available on credit cards and you need to have the full amount on that card for you to qualify. So it's been so much fun, so much. All right, so let's do some um, sneak peeks. Fine, let's do, do that one. Yeah, let's do it, let's do it. Do oh yes, it? oh yes. I love this it. is the bag that both me and Sarah were like oh going gosh, gaga geez. over. Oh I'll let you show first. It's so nice. Ready? How beautiful is this? Wow, Winnie. It I is can't believe stunning. we have this. I Again, know. since my two years of being here, this is the first time I've seen anything like this. This is so Such beautiful. A piece. So I think somebody was asking earlier on have you got any camera bags? To me, this is equivalent of a camera bag. Oh, look, meets, we're getting lots of lights. Yeah. People are meets loving it. Meets classic, meets Mademoiselle. And to me, most importantly, you just do not see these style of bags. And the, the, the condition on this is incredible. Wow, I'm in How love. soft is it? Oh, my God. It's butter-like. Yeah. It's so beautiful. I is it like believe. holding your baby niece or nephew? <laughs> yes. Yeah, it is like holding a baby, ba isn't a baby. it? <laughs> it's like a like, baby lamb, it's so cute. Yeah. And I, I honestly, I just, I love this. I love that it's different. Yes. That it has a leather strap and not the normal sort of like exactly. chain strap. Yeah. I think it just makes it just a little bit more understated in that perspective. Well. Exactly. And it looks great on your crossbody. Honestly, I feel like this is made for me. 
It's actually the perfect length on me as well, yeah. which I struggle with. I know, I know, because you're quite petite. Exactly. Yeah, so for size, Sarah is a, a five foot tall. Yeah. And it fits perfectly on yeah, you, crossbody. Yeah, I haven't tried it like this. Shoulder bag. It still fits still all right. Nice. Yeah, yeah it's it's hip, hip, nice. Just below hip height. Just below hip. Yeah. I love this. I'll let you talk about yeah, all the Yeah, sure. I mean, this. this is just absolutely stunning. It has all those the features that you guys in vintage lovers love is mademoiselle uh mademoiselle quilting is actually refers to the vertical quilting whenever you see mademoiselle in the title it means that it's got vertical quilting um the other type of quilting is chocolate bar which we showed earlier mm -hmm. on looks like a uh, actually looks like yeah it looks like a bar of chocolate so we'll just show you so this is mademoiselle quilting and this is the chocolate bar quilting which is squares and of course the classic, we've got the classic diamond quilting, which is, uh, which is this one, which is the matelasse. It's also known as matelasse. So they're not sort of the main three quiltings that normally come across in vintage Chanel. So this is uh, equivalent to a 10 inch medium size. It is quite high, so it's definitely a practical bag. It's amazing. It's so, so beautiful. Uh, original, uh, crafted from lambskin leather in that beautiful black colorway. The condition is excellent. Has that gorgeous quilted 24 karat gold gilding. Mm, I love, I love this. Yeah, it's just, it's really just so beautiful. different because it's kind of got an embezzled design. It's actually um, mimics the quilting on a classic flat bag. Mm. So it's not, sometimes the turnstile lock is smooth. But this isn't, so that prefer, doesn't add. I yeah, that it's not. Yeah, um, and it features a back pocket, very very handy, and it is so so gorgeous. Inside, it includes the dust bag, as well as a nice clean interior inside. Beautiful single flat bag. Does it come with card? Can't see one. Yes. Come to the card. It's a two series from 91 to 94, and this is incredible. And I know the price on this is very good. I'm doing a Sunday special price on this. Mm. This price is only 3,900 pounds. I think really that is a, an incredible price for a piece of vintage Chanel, which is 5,114 US. That such a unique piece yeah well. you just can't get i mean everyone has a classic bat but there's nothing wrong with that but not many people have this sort of style and i just even love the little hoop detailing there as well so for scale i'll just show it works for me i'll wear this as a crossbody style bag oh, so nice Winnie. Really. yeah and this bag has not been color retouched it's all original condition and for the shoulder strap it's perfect length for me as a shoulder strap, but I would wear it as a crossbody style bag. Yes. So to purchase, all you need to do, the product card has appeared. You just need to tap on that icon and it'll take you to the website where you can see further information and read the further, um, see uh, further pictures and you can add to cart. Uh, I am about five foot three and a half. Five foot three and a half? I don't know what that is in centimeters. A 163 cm. Ooh, <laughs> wow, you're like, Vivian, you're like the human Alexa, <laughs> which is equivalent to 165, 63, like 65, 65 like yeah. centimetres. Yeah. So I'm, I think I'm average height. Yes, so, you are. Yeah. So there. Okay, so somebody wanted to see some classic facts. We've got two. Let's do this one first. We'll do a nice unboxing. So for those who are um, waiting with bated breath, for the, I've got another classic flat 10 inch with a box. We're gonna reveal it right now. So we're doing a live unboxing. We're gonna have uh, this beautiful classic Chanel bag. Um, this is AWL2651. And this is the sought after 10 inch medium classic flat oh, bag. Yes. Comes with its dust bag as well. This one is all original condition. In beautiful look at that the beautiful lambskin leather and the 10 inch medium size we keep they just they keep selling we just don't can't get them in quick enough and this is a vintage version uh, 
Do you have a classic flat bag? I do. And what size do you have? Um, I actually have the jumbo that I bought in 2009 from Zalfadis. Yeah. Yeah, love mine. Still have it. Yeah. And yeah. is it lambskin? Or? It's lambskin, yeah, yeah, with gold hardware. Gold, gold. Exactly, oh, yeah. Amazing. Beautiful. And it's actually a single um, flap. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I think most, sometimes the jumbos are single flap. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, lovely and clean inside comes with a serial sticker this is a four series from 96 to 97 uh, so it comes no card but has a dust bag and box and it's in incredible condition really really beautiful it is so beautiful and this is the popular sought after 10 inch medium size so for scale to show me this is what it looks like on me after 10 inch i think 10 inch is actually a good size yeah uh, nine inch can be a bit too small, or nine inch is actually more, I think, good for evening wear. Yeah. Because it's small and you can wear it doubled up. I'll let um, Sarah model. On your shoulder. I wonder if this can be worn cross body as well. Yeah, you could try on you. you Probably on you, you can. Yeah. Yeah, you can on me. Yeah. yeah. It looks great on you yeah. as a cross body. So that as a cross body sits really comfortably. And then, of course, on the shoulder. I like it like that. I like it all three ways, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It really sits comfortably. And okay. honestly, classic flaps. It's just... It's Can't just, go... I mean, they keep going it's up it's and up and up. It's on its own as well. Yeah. So they're worth definitely piece. as an investment piece. So the price of this is only £4,400, which is $5,770 US dollars. That's an incredible price. That's a good, that's my Sunday special price. I would be normally charging this at $4,700. So really grab nice. this bag while you can. So okay. while we um, finish with that bag, put that back in, we also have, very unusually, we have, the classic in beige. Oh, this is a nine. Sorry, this is the nine-inch size. Actually, I think there was a spare dust bag. Oh no, that one. Yeah, that. yeah. This one I'm just going to put aside because I think it belongs to another bag. So we have uh, the beige colorway, which we very rarely get. This is the nine-inch size, and this is in beautiful condition for classic beige. I mean, it's amazing i can see lots of hearts yeah People are loving this yeah. and when it comes to classic chanel i always think beige is a good classic neutral color uh crafted from lambskin leather and the condition is amazing no color transfer it's all original it has not had any color um retouching the corners are amazing the gilding is incredible as well so this is the smaller nine inch uh, small size even that has been well looked after. Normally there's a, like an a, a indentation from where the, uh, the zipper has sat, but it's okay. And it's lovely and clean inside. Max is saying, I'm due to receive a square black flap from you guys. If I wanted to swap it for the one you have shown, is that possible? Please email customercare at luxurypromise.com with your uh, order number and um, someone will get back to you tomorrow. It is nice and clean inside, comes with a dust bag, and it has the original serial sticker. This is a uh, three, series. Th three series, so it's from 94 to 96. And I wonder if you could wear, try it on, so yeah, you sure. can wear it as a crossbody. Yeah, I love this. I know. It's so nice. Do you have a classic flat bag, you No, mean? that's my, like, goal. Yeah. Goal. What was your first designer bag, Vivian? My first designer bag was uh, um, a YSL a crossbody nice. with the little tassel. It's, oh, cute! It's a cute one. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. Blue. I they they are like those cape bags. They're yeah. they're, they're they're good. You know, you know, everyday yeah. bags. So yeah, definitely. I can definitely wear this crossbody. Oh, the color Looks is nice. gorgeous on you. Really nice. Do you have any beige bags? No, mm. I don't actually. Yeah. Actually, no, I've got a little Laura Piana pouch, the yeah. ostrich one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, did I tell you about yeah, that? Yeah, 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 you got that one. I love that. But yeah. We very rarely get Laura Piana yeah. items. It's I think not. Yeah, yeah, Laura Piana is, the quality is just as good as Hermes. 
just as yeah, good. Yeah, the, the, the craftsmanship's amazing. Oh my God, I love the Laura Piana. Yeah. Have you seen the little cup? Yeah, 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 yeah. I know okay. which one. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so yeah, this one is really beautiful. And Winnie, I, again, I know I keep saying the same thing, but I actually genuinely mean it. In the two years that I've been here, we barely get these ones that are also buttery. They tend to be a little bit more like yeah, matte. Yeah, but exactly. The, this, but this one's so buttery. Yeah. In beautiful condition as well. So, so really hear it from find. Sarah, who's our sales associate. Yeah. She works here at the weekend at our South Bolton Street store and she pretty much knows our stock as well. So even she says she's not seen one this incredible yeah. for a long time. For a long, long time. Yeah. Yeah. Really nice piece. And the price will be revealed it is uh, 4,700 pounds which is 6,163 euros dollars we notice it's slightly more than the black one because that's the rarity right. of this color it's been so long since we last got a this condition in black and remember we are still compared to other resellers we're still at least four to five hundred pounds cheaper than most resellers so we bring you the best prices so that's why you have to continue watching this uh, yeah. live show. I've got another half an hour. <laughs> this condition looks amazing, Fanny. It, yeah. yeah, I know. I Immaculate. Know. Do you have any Chanel caviar bags? I do actually, I'll show that next. If you pop that inside, yeah. I'll grab the Chanel. We have this one. This is a privilege with Jumbo. Um, this is amazing. We do love caviar skin. Caviar skin, um, is one of those uh, durable leathers that uh, not only luxurious but durable and easy to look after and maintain and when it comes to in the resale market in the secondary market in the vintage market we very rarely get we get a lot of lamb skin and calf skin but very rarely um, caviar skin so I'm very excited to show you this beautiful vintage jumbo um, flat bag it is beautiful uh, it features the caviar skin. It's almost like an equivalent to a cellier, a Hermes cellier bag with this structured side. So I do like these because it actually maintains the shape. It's yeah. a good way of maintaining shape. It features the back pocket. And this is 12 inches across, so slightly bigger. The, it features the hardware, which is in excellent condition, lovely and clean inside. And it includes the wonderful care booklet, as well as the authenticity card and this is a five series from 90 uh 97 to 99 so uh, i don't know if you guys ever seen me read out these booklets no, no so these ever. these this is this is where i learn everything <laughs> <laughs> this is the bible guys so these are chanel care booklets um, that were provided for uh, bags made in the 80s and 90s. And it tells you really in depth how to look after your bag. So for example, one of the things that I found very, very interesting uh, was um, greasy marks can be removed with unscented talcum powder, sprinkle on the mark, leave overnight and brush over gently with a clean uh, makeup brush. Yeah, is that really, yeah. really, really so, yeah. So simple. Exactly. And another uh, item, very interesting. The metal parts of your handbag are gilded with an alloy containing 24 karat gold. So we're not just saying it, it is there in writing, in reference. And sometimes it's, it's um, so definitely, you know, won't go on too much because we haven't got much time. So yes. So it, it is incredible. Love this condition of the bag. Features is it's a single flap with a long strap, and you can wear this as a crossbody style. So this is equivalent to your jumbo size, yeah. you reckon? I'd, mine's probably a bit more rectangular. Yeah. Yeah, but it's similar. It's very, it's very similar. similar. And you can wear it over the shoulder as well, and you can demonstrate. I think we've sold. Oh, we got someone just bought the beige. Oh, someone oh. has just bought the beige. Congratulations. Congratulations. A very, very good buy. That is an excellent buy. And uh, we've already um, put it in a protective covering for you. And it'll be out for uh, shipping tomorrow. Thank you so, so much. So how did that look like on you? Yeah, so it's a little big, but it's, yeah, it's cute. It's really nice. It's <laughs> do you like vintage Vivian? I do. I now you work so here. Nice. Vivian has joined. How long have you worked with us now? A month. A month, yeah. yeah. And you're now getting the hang of yeah. vintage. Yeah. And this is like within my birth year. I'm like 99 baby. Oh. oh. So this one's it's like always so sentimental once 
yeah is when you know it's your birthday exactly yeah. oh so anyone born in 97 to 99 this is the same year as you i mean chanel bags and hermes bag mm. age better than a human <laughs> <laughs> honestly right what is your Thank secret you. bag yeah. tell us mm. <laughs> yeah, so right so um right Vivian, you tell us what would you like us to show next Hold on one sec, let me put the price up really Okay, quick. oh, forgot to say the price of that one. Oh, yeah. It's free. <laughs> it is only £4,995, which is 6550 US dollars. And all you need to do is just tap mm -hmm. on that icon and it could be yours. <laughs> um, let me see. So what shall we show next? Or what do you guys want to see next? Usually, um, What's that pink more one? accessories oh, or bags. The pink one, this is cute. Yeah, I'm obsessed with pink. Yeah, yeah, this is actually really, really cute. This was actually featured on Sade's show earlier last week. And um, this is actually a Louis Vuitton vernis bag. And, but it's so clever, I'll just show it's you beautiful. this. It's got that beautiful sort of marshmallow -y pink with a, a crossbody style fichette leather strap. But it's actually their version of a wallet on chain. So you oh, open no it, way. you open up that way, and you open up that way. Oh wow! Isn't that clever? Wow! Can you see that? That's so clever. That oh, is so, it is so clever. I think this is such a useful bag. That's very cute. It's so cute, it's right? Really cool. So it's got an internal zip pocket there. It has like eight card holders in there. It has sections so yeah, to hold your cash and whatever you need. You can even fit a phone if you put it in this bit section, not a problem. <laughs> Yeah. Should we try? Yes. Should we try? Oh, I can see where you like the pink. Yeah. I know. <laughs> so let's try. Let's slip that through. Um, yeah. Oh, it fits. That's really cool. Yeah. It closes. Oh, yes, it does. It closes well. So it fits an iPro phone 11, wasn't it? Your yes. phone. Yeah. So really, Absolutely. I think this is like the one bag that could, it's like the Swiss Army knives or yeah. bags. It's yeah. got everything you need. <laughs> it is a vintage item. It's that Verney leather. Just want to show it. There is some colour discoloration. Can you see? There's some colour discoloration there. But the back is fine, in good usable condition. And it features this strap. Now, this strap can be worn like a crossbody style, like so. Really cool and comfortable. So lightweight. Feels so like lightweight. Nice. But also you can wear it around your waist. Ah, oh, no yeah. way. Oh, That's right. Yes. Yeah, so How do if, I do this? So if I um, unbuckle this, I think you just, uh, how do I do it? I saw it earlier. I think just about. Like that? Yeah, <laughs> just about like that. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just being... Maybe it wasn't oh. designed to be. Was it? Maybe it was too short to be a strap. Oh, yeah. I think it worked work on me. I don't think if it doesn't work on you, it doesn't work on me. Does it have more holes? I don't think it's not long enough. Oh, it's, it's not, not long, long enough. enough. Yeah. Okay. However, it's got um, enough belt loops at the back. Mm -hmm. If you've got a thin enough belt, you can actually belt it through an additional yeah. strap, uh, belt strap. And you can use that yeah. as a, so let's put that. But really cool. Still, you're able to use it cross body and on the shoulder as yeah, well. Yeah, very practical. Lots of usage, different usages. Let me just put that on. But however, I think that's a cross body bag. This is perfect. Love it. And don't you think it's just so lightweight? Very lightweight. You can't even feel it on you. Yeah. And it's baby pink. Baby pink. Yeah, exactly. so this is vintage. This is from um, the Verney leather, which is the enamel leather, the shiny leather, actually was uh, brought in by Mark Jacobs in the Y2K area, yeah. uh, era. And um, he, yeah, so it's, this is Mark Jacobs' era of Louis Vuitton. So the price will be revealed. It is only £320. I think that's super cheap. That is such a great price. And you're going to get loads of cost per wear out of it. It's a no-brainer, which is only 419 US dollars, and it's available there. You, all you need to do is just tap on that icon. So, um, I'm actually going to go off kilter. You might kill me, Vivian, but I've just seen a bag <laughs> I need to feature. Just give me one second. Yeah. I'll shout yeah. out the skew. I know exactly which one you're about to pick. Oh, I my God! <laughs> no! I was going to hire it. <laughs> I'm going to look out for all the 
like. Yeah, no. if 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 it's out on display, I'm going to show it. So this is incredible. This is you might have to find it in the. Um, yeah. It is A W L three one o nine. A W L three one. How gorgeous is this? Seriously. So we had the Mamzelle earlier. The Mamzelle can be both vertical and horrid. Oh, you can see the hearts. Yeah, Sarah. I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> it can be both vertical, but it can also be horizontal. So this is the jumbo Mamzelle with the horizontal, the rare horizontal quilting. And <laughs> someone's going, what is this? Oh my God. <laughs> because the jumbo hardware, I know. And, and it's incredible. It's caviar skin. It oh, is that beautiful, almost like a, in between a chocolate brown and then a caramel color. It is stunning. An absolute stunning piece. Love this. Oh, this is so beautiful. Beautiful. I love this. Yeah. It's so rare. Honestly, it's Winnie, all the stock, most of the stock, I've just not seen before. Yeah, it's fun, right? It's so Hence fun. Hence why we're doing the Sunday <laughs> yeah. shows. Sometimes it's nice to re recap what we've got yeah. on offer because we do have incredible stock. Really nice pieces. Yeah. Lovely and clean inside. It includes the cereal sticker. This is what size is this? This one, she, this one is What's, what year is it? Um, 94 to 96. So, this is a three series from 94 to 96, and the condition is amazing for a vintage piece. It does have some light signs of wear, it is a vintage piece. They've got some scuffing on the corners there and there, but the main body is nice and clean just beautiful and the gold gilding is excellent it's a single flat crafted from caviar skin leather Love this. This. the lovely sarah um, dem, um model she's a petite five foot tall and actually the jumbo is a good size on Love it. it i already tried it on today already <laughs> so, <I'm not laughs> yeah. today <laughs> so this is equivalent to 12 inches it's a it's the jumbo size bag love this yeah and would you like playing around with the strap or you think the double strap I, on its own? On me, on me, I think the double on its own is perfect. Yeah. On a taller person, maybe they can try crossbody, but I love it. Like yeah. This. yeah. And it sits really, I think it's very classy, it's very ladylike like this as well. So. Yeah, definitely. And and I quite like the, uh, the chains definitely have some weight to it, but I yeah. like that because it feels like you've got something there. Yeah, you know exactly. I mean? Yeah, I often think the jumbo size... It just looks too big to be worn as a crossbody. Mm, to I me, agree. it just looks more classy if you wear it a double strap like Agreed. this. Yeah. It's good. Love it, Lynn. Uh, Thaney's asked, I'm a sticker, f a sticker for condition. You all think the corner wear is okay? Yes, I mean, it is a vintage piece. It does have some scuffing. It does have light scuffing, but it doesn't affect the overall integrity of the bag. It won't, like, it's not going to wear down into make it into a hole or anything like that but the main body is incredible and also guys you know that we don't rarely get these colors in no not that yeah. color of brown as well yeah <laughs> <laughs> vivian's having kittens because she really wants a bag <laughs> yeah so you just don't get this color uh we don't even get the vertical that this horizontal um uh, yeah. quilting that often so the last time I saw something similar like this, my sister actually has it. Mm. Uh, she bought it about 10 years ago from Vintage Place, and it was Jersey. Oh, nice. So this is not only due to the rarity, it's as jumbo, it has uh, the original cereal sticker cut, um, vertical, it's caviar, and plus is that beautiful, almost chocolate brown, milk, like milk chocolate brown colorway. It's incredible. And it's so, exactly, it's so hard to find in caviar skin. So this price is £5,995, which is US dollars And the image has just appeared. All you need to do is just tap on that icon. And the hardware is excellent. It's in great condition. There you go, there. Thank you. Uh, let's move on to... Uh, Should we put this one? Yes, Fendi. Yeah. Yeah. This is a fun bag. Yeah. yeah. This is a fun bag. You love your exotic. I love exotic. You bought something <laughs> recently, haven't you? I remember you were telling me, what did you buy? Was it a python or something like that? I'll put it maybe to your python yeah, that I'm that's... obsessed with. Yeah. I've got the Fendi peekaboo in python as well. And then obviously some of the Laura Piana ostrich pattern yeah. as well. I, I'm a sucker for it. So. Oh, so you've got more than one python. Yeah. Wow. wow. So this is the Fendi Peekaboo, uh, not Peekaboo, sorry, a Fendi Baguette, Mama Baguette in the Python um, 
leather. And this is an, it's a beautiful colour. It's almost like Love a it. dusty pink. It's like a dust pink, is that? Yeah, it? beautiful dusty pink. It's in great condition. The scales are in great condition. I uh, love this enamel hardware. Mm -hmm. See that? So, yeah, it's like a marble. Yeah, so I was about to say. It looks like a marble offset with silver hardware. It's, it's magnetic closure. It's the mama baguette, so it's a larger sort of a larger size a baguette size. Uh, definitely you can fit an iPad, wallet, your latest phone, and it's in very good clean condition. Uh, just see the bottom. Light wear to the bottom, but majorly the corners are in good clean condition. And I'll let you model that first. Very oh, it's cute. Really comfortable as well. Yeah. Really comfortable. Yeah, I think it's cute. And the fact that you can just like look in as well. Yeah. Very practical. Very, very practical. Ah. Uh. I love this. The yeah, feature. I know. I like the fact it's blue. It really yeah. offsets the pink. Yeah. It definitely Perfect works. Perfect for spring, summer. Yeah, definitely, definitely works. So good. And I'll try it on now. So, Sarah is five foot tall and I'm about five foot three and a half. So, this nice. is a really good size. Um, it's uh, shoulder length. It can't go any longer. It does have adjustable um, options here to go shorter, but it's on the longest length at the moment. So this Fendi Python bag is only six hundred and fifty pounds. Wow, that is a brilliant price. For I Python. thought, it, yeah, I thought it'd be in the thousand pound range. Yeah. That's really, really good for Python. Um, doesn't have its sighties. Um, it is eight hundred and fifty-two US dollars, and the product has just appeared. If you love this bag, and there's a great, I mean, we sell the canvas versions in the seven hundred pound range. So for a Python um, baby pink like dusty pink of a mama baguette that's an incredible price really so, nice. sandy says it reminds me of sabrina oh, ah yeah. sabrina loves her pink yeah <laughs> so this is very much a sabrina pink this colorway is like a sabrina pink. <laughs> so if you love this bag you want to see further information on this bag all you need to do is just tap on that icon yeah so we have also in fendi we have if you want the classic um uh Sukino print we have one here. This is a canvas print with an enamel um, layer over the top. Features the gold tone hardware. Um, it's got like a waterproof PVC exterior. So definitely for rainy London. Yes. This is very, very practical. It is. Uh, it's the same mama baguette size. Got the gold tone hardware. Magnetic closure. And it is nice and clean inside as well with an interior zip pocket. And this is the FF uh, Zucker print. This, yeah, this is the Zucker print design, and you can see. But I really like the gold against the brown. Yeah, really cute. Yeah, very, very cute. I do like the Zucker print as mm. well. Really good. And the price will be shortly revealed. And this is a vintage piece from the 90s. And this bag is also £650, which is $852. US dollars. And shortly the product card will appear. So imagine the Python is actually a fantastic deal. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's a yeah. great price. Definitely a great price. So if you have just joined and you want to see what we have featured so far, there is a handbag icon just here. So you need to tap on that icon and you can see what we have featured so far in this collection. We, we have, have yeah, we let's have do, I, I was just thinking yeah. that. So let me just show you some sneak peek items that we, which we'll make live right now. Um, we found that suddenly in London we're snowing again, right? Yeah, it's insane. It is insane. Like it's last insane. week we were in flip flops and now we're in like snow winter, boots. Yeah, in snow boots. Yeah. So um, I just thought, we well, you know what? You, you can never go wrong with a good scarf. So we this. have this gorgeous Fendi scarf with the Fendi print, which is very clever, and it's a two-tone colorway. So you've got the um, dark gray and brown one side, and then the other side is the um, light gray and with the light gray um, logo. And it's lovely and clean inside, and it features the original sticker uh, sewing labels. Where did I just see? Um, here. Yeah. 
so it's got the original sewing labels and this is a hundred percent wool made in italy and i love a good scarf you do I, I have you a lot always of, wear scarves yeah i have a lot of scarves i just feel like it's one of the you just can't go wrong with a scarf yeah. right so um you can definitely it's a definitely a neck scarf it is around about 168 centimeters long and around about uh, 40 centimeters wide uh, a good unisex piece yeah for men and women and is in great condition yeah. This is how I usually, I, I, I tend to wear scarves like an old woman, but I really like it. Uh, oh, you look like a stylish Harry Potter. <laughs> this is how I actually wear my scarves. So. Yeah, yeah. So this is a lovely conditioned scarf. This is only £155. So Great good. price, isn't it? And wait. wait Where's that? Where it? Yeah. Oh, now you're rocking. Yeah, and it goes with <laughs> the bag just there. So if you, basically, you can buy that and that for less than £800. Exactly. So you Good get, set. Yeah, it's a, you get the whole vintage set for less than £800. So yeah. uh, it is just coming up the scarf. Really good price, by the way, for the scarf. Yeah, it's really a great price. price. Yeah, yeah. Well, it is a Winnie Sunday show. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, there's a good reason why you watch short eye shows. Ah. Uh, Thaney is saying, I'm torn between the Big CC Lambskin Diamond Quilting or the Big CC Mademoiselle uh, Jumbo. Which one's the Big CC? Ah! Oh. Which one the... Oh. So you mean you're torn between this one <laughs> and this... Oh. The, the black one. That, that, that one. one. Oh, that I would be <sighs> torn. Oh my I God. I can't decide for you, my love, because <laughs> there are both incredible bags. And they... It's really hard to say to go for which one. They're both just as rare. Honestly, They're both. What could we advise her? It's such a hard. Like that I'm normally a very like decisive yeah. person, but this. Honestly, because they both are, I, I can't even choose. I don't know. Yeah, I really don't know. So so nice. I love this. What do you I think? The brown. You think the brown? The brown. Vivian's really? saying it's the brown. In some ways, I can kind of get that because I think. This will, out of the two, they're both hard to get, but this one is, un, I don't think we'll get again for a long, long time. But I've never seen this though, Winnie. Have yeah. you, tell me, have you seen this? I, ha I think I've come across one with a chain. Okay. Uh, but not, I love this, I like the leather strap. I much prefer it. Yeah, love, but this style, and I know Mademoiselle bags are quite good investment pieces. Uh, for this one, it, it's just, it's the hottest investment Fine. bag right now. So probably, Oh, it's really hard. Out of the two, <laughs> yeah, like I would say it's like uh, 41, no, 41 and 59. Is that the right? Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah just mean. by 1%. <laughs> Hope that helps. So maybe yeah, you guys, for as well, let's right? ask the, everybody on the show, yeah. which one should Thaney get? She should go for the brown or she should get the for the vintage black? Everyone's going brown. Oh, really? Yeah. It's it is harder to get brown though, isn't it? And I love like the jumbles. You love yeah. Them. Oh, she's but she says she yeah. loves black and brown. Oh, it's hard. It it's is hard. Really hard. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of people are saying the brown. Yeah. Oh God. Well, while Thaney, <laughs> if you while you guys giving Thaney advice and she ponders, <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to move on to the next scarf. This is this is very much a used scarf. First of all, it's Hermes. Lovely. And it's cashmere. Oh God. Anything cashmere belongs to me. I love cashmere. I love cashmere. I have a whole cupboard full of cashmere. Do you? Yeah. And I buy all types of cashmere. Yeah. Like, but you can tell the more expensive cashmere, the quality is a bit better. Always, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've so, never actually seen um, Hermes cashmere. So yeah, this is a vintage piece. I would wow. say 80s, 90s. It's a light, almost like a pea, mint pea suit colour. What a beautiful colour. I know. And it's 100% cashmere made in Scotland. And it has that discreet, if you're looking for, I think it'd be Father's Day soon, looking for a men's gift, this is a great gift. It has the embroidered Hermes logo just there. And it really, has really the nice. original um, sewing label just there as well. So everyone's voting Team Brown. Mm. <laughs> oh, it's hard. Oh, it, my, is hard. It, it is so hard. But yeah, so how would you wear this? This is so cute with um, your blazer. Yeah. Yeah. And you can't go wrong with scarves. Scarves no. are 
One of those accessories are timeless, good investment. You get a lot of wear out of them. There's always going to be a winter. Yeah. Always. Yes. Looks cute. Ah. Oh, quite a few people are saying black now. Oh, are they? Oh, it's hard. Poor thing. Yeah. I, I don't want to be in her position. I don't want to be in her position. It's hard. It's like choosing between your son or your daughter. Literally. It's hard. It's like, I don't want to ever be in that position. This is, this is super lightweight and really, yeah, really beautiful. Really, really lightweight. And really warm as well. Yeah. Um, I don't have any backpacks in this show. The only backpack I have is the Prada backpack, which is £295. But I know you are after Louis Vuitton and Chanel. Um, if you head over to the website and just put in the search bar um, Chanel backpack or Louis Vuitton backpack, hopefully something will come up. Uh, did so, we talk about the price for this one? No, not yet. The price will be short. This is only £185 for, for Hermes cashmere. 100% Hermes cashmere in great condition, no stains, no tears, uh, no moth holes. It's a, I would say it's quite a thick ply uh, cashmere, so it's very, very worn. Not very, um, it's not worn at all, and it keeps you very, very warm. So, yeah. Okay, laptop cases. Uh, Hannah, please watch my show tomorrow at 7 p.m. I may have a laptop case in that show. So watch, uh, that will definitely fit a 15 inch laptop. And I think the one I'm showing tomorrow is, is Louis Vuitton. So keep an eye tomorrow. Okay, uh, so let me just feature these shoes. Yes. Okay, so we've got, if you love your desert ankle boots and you love Chanel, these are super cool. Actually, these will look cool. With this Hermes scarf, actually. Um, we'll yeah. Talk about this one next. Oh, is that somebody wants to see that? Oh yeah, yeah, we'll just do that. Yeah. So, um, uh, whatever happened to the Fendi scarf? Did it sell? I don't see it. Did it sell? The thing didn't work. Oh, did it not? Mm -hmm. Oh, would do you mind just showing off this shoes yeah, while I have a look? Yeah, probably because it's not. It's a so army green oh, and tweed. What size are these? I just check out this size. Size 39. So these are almost like a high top type of yeah. boot. Yeah. And in I think these are these are actually never worn, unworn shoes. The link for the Fendi scarf is just there. Hope that works. Wait, yeah. no, these are are these unworn? These are only worn once inside her home. Nice. Like you women, can tell. you know when you're in the shop, you're like, oh, I like the shoes. Yeah, I think they'll fit. I think yeah. they'll work. When you get home, you're like, it doesn't work. Yeah. And I can't return There's them. literally no scuff at yeah. all. Yeah, yeah. And it's I love a, this detail. And it's actually the same lady who has the, um, who owned these trainers. Oh, nice. Yeah, so she, she has incredible shoe taste. Really? She yeah, loves she, her tweets. Yeah, really? she loves her tweets. She loves her tweets. And these are in great condition. I just love it. Mm, really I mean, nice. they're fun. They're little de desert boots with a CC toe cap with a khaki green. Um, they, look, they look incredibly comfortable. They are size 38. No, uh, 39, I 30, believe. Yeah, 39. Yes, it's a size 39. Fits true to size. I would say Chanel shoes are a little bit narrow, so I would go down half a size. So if you're 38 and a half, this would be perfect for you. Or 38, this would be perfect as well. And the boots will be coming up next. And they've only been worn once. Just light wear to the, to the soles. No scuffing to the toe, toe caps. The heels are nice and clean. I think just fun, fun shoes. They are fun. Yeah. <laughs> blue Chanel. Somebody said blue Chanel. Don't think we've got any blue Chanel. Oh, that Chanel. Oh, oh gosh, they, they've got good eyesight. Good sight. Good eyesight. <laughs> good eyesight. <laughs> so these shoes are four hundred ninety-five pounds, which is six hundred and forty-nine US dollars. Again, you know, really good for Chanel shoes. Yeah, which they're double the price <laughs> now, aren't they? Literally eight hundred pounds. That's bare minimum these yeah. days. Yeah. Yeah. So let's showcase this. So. Our final bag for today is this Chanel um, little double envelope style bag. Uh, this is AWC 1096. Um, it's actually 
Is that blue or indigo? To me, it looks like... Um, Indi- I'd say it's like a purpley blue. Yeah, it's, indigo, yeah. yeah it's a purpley blue, more like an indigo colour. It's crafted from lambskin leather, and it's a vintage piece. And what's really fun, it's got double envelope style set flaps. So you've got one um, compartment here, and you've got another compartment here as well. Uh, I've tucked in the strap so you can actually wear this as a clutch style bag. But actually, it has its own little inbuilt um, shoulder strap. So you really could, cool. it's so cool, isn't it? It's a cool piece. It's yeah, cool. it's just unusual. Yeah. Um, has the little side strap there. Lovely condition. And the colour is, it is just wow. Really beautiful colour. Gold, gold tone hardware with original 24 karat gold gilding. You can wear this as a high, actually no, it's, it's okay as a yeah, cross, right? Yeah, yeah definitely. Crossbody style bag. And you can wear it over the shoulder as well. A very, very practical bag. And it has compartments one there and an internal compartment there. It includes its serial sticker only and it's a one series from 1989 to 91. And I'll let Sarah, Sarah, um, demonstrate as well. Zara, for, for reference, is a uh, five foot tall. This bag is £2,000, which is 2622 US dollars. Hannah, so did I miss this bag that was behind the blue Chanel? Oh no, the Fendi, the Fendi dot bag. We'll make that our last bag, actually. Yeah. Gosh, they have got good, good eyesight. Really, really, really good. good. Did we, have we t- spoken about the price? On yeah, £2,000. Yeah. £2, now, Hannah, stay on because this is, I know this is an incredible price. Um, oh, it's so fun, this bag. It's super fun. It's such a cool bag. I wanted to show actually the Fendi dot bag. Um, it's in lovely condition. It features the beautiful little floral hardware, all the applique designs. And it's crafted from smooth black um, leather with a top handle. And it has a detachable shoulder strap as well. Yeah, we'll do the, the square flap afterwards. Someone's sure. just asking, yeah. Sure. I think we sold the scarf. We could just let us know. Yes. Yeah? Nice. Oh, Fendi amazing. Scarf. The Fendi scarf is just sold. Congratulations. Congratulations. Now the Fendi dot bag uh, it's very practical because it features oh wow a little bonus pouch really yeah cute. isn't that really cute? cute it's got a little um, dis- um a detachable pouch you can use this often on its own yeah t- i would yeah or as a little you know as a little clutch bag or something to keep your documents inside or your personal items inside and it fits just here slots in just there so it's got compartment one and it also has compartment two at the back. And it comes with its original uh, Fendi dust bag as well. I mean, this is an incredible condition bag. Yeah. Yeah. I'll let you have a look. What do you think? I really like it. It's cute. It's isn't perfect it? for like work. Yeah, I think it's you, a good work bag. It's a really good work bag. Really, really practical. And also like super stylish. Like, yeah. You definitely notice that like, people would notice it. Yeah. You can wear it crossbody. Yeah, you can. And yeah. it's super comfortable as well. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, Definitely. I think it could fit a 13-inch MacBook Air. So a smaller, yeah. light um, MacBook. Definitely. Um, this price is only £750. Wow. That is an incredible bag really, for a Fendi really Dot good. bag. £750 or 983 US dollars. And all you need to do is just tap on that icon. I love the detachable strap as well. Yeah, it is. You can add it to like other bags as well. Yeah, it's just so, so handy. Right, so we'll move on to the little square flap. Oh, something has just sold. Not too sure what. Uh, Oh, it's the gold earrings. Oh, the Chanel gold earrings have just sold. Incredible. Amazing. Congratulations. It's a good purchase. That is a very good purchase. So, somebody was asking about the square Chanel classic flat bag. We have this vintage one. This is a seven inch mini size. It's a size and style that they don't produce anymore. It's discontinued. Okay. So making this one of a kind vintage. It's crafted from lambskin leather and it features the gold tone hardware as well. 
so it's really really sweet uh comes with its dust bag uh, not dust bag sorry authenticity card and serial sticker and it's one series from 1989 to 91 i'll just take out the strap this is in really good lovely clean condition i'll just show you the wet lambskin leather nice and clean and it's just the perfect little everyday cross style bag cross body style bag and i'll let you model for reference sarah is a, a five foot tall and it fits you perfectly yeah really body. nice yeah it's a good length very nice yeah length. the skew on this one okay the skew is should be inside I may have picked this up by accident. Maybe I haven't got this. I don't know. Okay, there is cute. Oh, there it is. Yeah. It's in lovely condition. Yeah, really beautiful on the inside as well. Yeah. I think my next bag, my next vintage, is going to be a seven inch. You think so? Yeah. yeah. I think I will get a lot of wet use I out think of these. so. Jo I think Joanna has one of these. Yeah. 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 I've seen her wear it. I've as been well. very practical bags. Yeah, really nice. I do have a, a nine inch small classic flap, but the cost is sat high, so it's okay. a bit like, like this. Yeah. <laughs> again. Whereas this is just the perfect. perfect. And I feel like this bag I can wear with jeans. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Whereas the Chanel classic, it's a bit like I need to wear a posh. Formal. Yeah, yeah, a bit more formal. This is informal. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. I like it with what you're wearing now. Jeans yeah. and trainers as well. Yeah, exactly. So the price will be featured shortly, Hannah. Just give us a few minutes while we pin the price. And I'll just quickly show you the condition one more time. Nice, good, clean condition. Buy it. Oh, my God. I just bought a Kelly earlier this week. <laughs> I can't. I, I've blocked. So uh, uh, it, this bag is £3,800, which is US dollars And the uh, icon will shortly appear. Good price. It's a really good price. It includes the serial sticker and card. It's a one series from 1989 to 91. It's ideally worn as a crossbody style uh, bag. It's a lot has a long drop, and it has the original 24 karat um, gold gilding. <laughs> right. Thank you. That is um. Oh, somebody wants to see the patent. Let me just show. I hope. Let me just grab the name. Uh, somebody wanted to see the painter, didn't they? Uh, I can't remember who it was, but I'll show the painting one more time. If you don't mind pinning this bag, that'd mm -hmm. be great, Vivian. So this is the painting uh, Chanel classic, uh, Chanel dome style bag, uh, crafted from paint and leather. The price on this is only £1,495. Um, it's a four series from 96 to 97. The uh, gold gilding is excellent and it features the little CC, uh, not little, it's a large CC yeah. embroidered logo on the bottom. Uh, overall, the um, paint leather is not sticky. It's in really good condition. Yeah. Sometimes the vintage one, can they, feel, they can feel a bit sticky and it hasn't lost its enamel as well. However, there is one scuff mark that I need to bring to attention. It is just here where the enamel has lost, and so it's slightly patchy there. But apart from that, the main body of the bag is in nice and clean condition. So serial sticker only, love that little Chanel detail on the side. And it's ideally worn as a over the shoulder bag. So there, so, uh, oh well. May I see the Chanel bag that's just behind Sarah, behind the pink bag. Which bag was that? Oh, the jump. Oh, yes. So this is the caviar skin, um, hate, uh, caviar skin jumbo bag. I believe the price on this is £4,995. It's in great condition. It's a five series from 97 to 99. Uh, so it's a jumbo, so it's equivalent to 12 inches across. And I would say this is all equivalent to like a cellier style bag. So it's got a very structured side. So um, it, it maintains its shape. It's ideally worn um, over the shoulder or crossbody. Oh, it's, you wear it yeah. crossbody. It's, uh, yeah, so it's only a single flat bag. And it comes with its card and dust bag. Uh, sorry, card booklet. Yeah, card and booklet. Four, nine, nine, five. 
Yeah, this is 4,995 pounds, five series. So this looks great as a crossbody style bag. This is actually, as an everyday bag, this is probably yeah. a better size bag, right? Yes, it is, exactly. Yeah. And I'll just show you the condition one more time. Sandy wishes this could be a work bag. What kind of work do you do, Sandy? <laughs> that's a, I think that's quite a decent sized bag. Yeah. Yeah. Could it fit? Yeah, definitely fit an iPad. Do we have the company what iPad here? Uh, yes, we do, actually. There, let me just show you our, our iPad. <clears throat> so we've got the company iPad here. Yep. Yeah, fits perfectly. No problem. Uh, also, Sarah, I'm also five foot tall. Would you mind wearing it? Yes, of course. So Hannah is also five foot tall. I found this one a little bit too long. Long, yeah. However, Absolutely. you can Personally, get though. yeah, you can get um, chain shorteners. Yes, exactly. Yeah, exactly. is it from Chanel directly? You can, or Amazon as well. Yeah. Oh, I know how to do it. Do oh, you? All right. Okay, Vivian's going to demonstrate how we can shorten it. Show me. Without having to get a <laughs> chain. Just give Otherwise, a... yeah, you can get those little clippers from Chanel. Yeah. And, um... Oh, oh okay, yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, yeah. Oh, that's That's really a good cool. idea. Yeah. That's oh, a good that's idea. that's really cool. So what we've done is we've looped the chain underneath the flap. Like that. So this works as uh, yeah. an over-the-shoulder bag as well. Or you can wear it as in the crook of your arm. But definitely you can get... Oh, Zaini said a safety pin would work too. Really? Good, yeah. If you get okay. a thick... I suppose if you get the thick... Ones, yeah. yeah, you could just loop it up and shorten it in that way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and then that way you could probably still have it cross body. Um, yeah, and just have it a tiny bit shorter. Sure. Uh, Rhonda wants to see are uh, the corners scuffed. We'll just show you that in one second. We'll show you the score. The corners are not scuffed. There's actually no major wear to this bag because it's caviar skin. It's very very durable, so we can't see any major wear of scuffing. It's overall in good, clean condition. There's no scuffing to the back, no, no scuffing to the front, no. and the hardware is also excellent with no tarnish. Uh, so. Yes, we are covering all your duties and customs, Katiana. Katina. So don't worry about that. Uh, okay. So price in USD for that bag: four thousand nine hundred ninety-five. Give us one second, we're just working out the conversion. What was your favourite items for today? I'd Who's like asking? To... No, I'm just I'm oh. asking you guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, before we we've got five minutes now. Uh it is six thousand five hundred and fifty US dollars, Rhonda. Yeah. Uh right, so yes, we've got five minutes left. What was your favourite thing shown today? What was your favourite thing shown today? The Chanel. This, oh, that one, yeah, yes. that is rather well, well, lovely. Be my favorite. Yeah. Uh, has what was your favorite, Vivian? The brown. Oh, the brown. The brown. Yeah, the brown. Yeah, I think for me, it is that one actually, yeah, and me. the brown. Mm -hmm. I don't think we made Thaney's. Oh, off. actually, no way. What? These oh are, yeah. I forgot about these. These are really cute. Yeah, they're these. really really. I cute. love these. Yeah. Oh my god, but there's so many nice pieces. The lipstick I know. bag. And oh, like, get the lipstick bag. The lipstick bag. bag, the heart bag. Oh, guys, let's oh just quickly god. pin the <laughs> lipstick bag because this is only three and a half thousand. I think it's a really good yeah. price for a collectible. I forgot about this one. Oh, I love that I love one. It. Yeah. That was actually too many to mention yeah. now. This, guys, is so cute. Love that. This is a very a collectible piece. This is from 2004, 2005. Look at that little mini lipstick and little mirror. Super and cool. it is so small i mean you could put like credit cards in there or so like a lipstick. lipstick a couple of lipstick but keys. it doesn't matter because you know when you wear this out it is so cute very very oh cute God. and you can wear this as a crossbody this I think would actually, so cute on my knees yeah there. this would be my uh, i love that this will be my uh top choice today yes i'd, I'd say so yeah it. yeah so nice. yeah exactly so before we finish uh but uh, let me just look up the the Bay Chanel double flap from Dubai was not shown here today, but the duties will still be covered. Yes, it will be, Katina. 
Uh, Sandy, is there two percent of the site still? There Where? was there was a two percent. What? Sabrina was giving a two percent off. Yes. Was that a, a, was that a famous a Sabrina slasher price? Sabrina, I I saw it really randomly. It was she. They're, they're uh, wrong, they're yeah, if if 2%. the code still works, go ahead and try. try it. I, I I this is the first time I've heard of it. Yes. So try it, Sandy. <laughs> Quickly get in that code before it expires. Yes. <laughs> so thank you so much for joining us today. I had loads of fun. I had so much fun, by the way. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, oh, it was to celebrate Ramadan. Oh, of oh, course. Oh, nice. Yes. So it's Eid Mubarak. Is that Thank you. No, it's well, right now it's Ramadan Mubarak. Right well, now. okay. So Eid Mubarak is afterwards. Exactly. Oh. I'm fasting today, by the way. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And you look amazing. Thank you so much. I'm surprised you don't want to eat your own thumb. <laughs> I'm already thinking, like, is, what am I, what I'm going to be having for fast later, Oh, I so. see. So for those who are celebrating Ramadan, um, thinking of you when you're fasting and when you break fast, is, is it uh, when sundown? Yes, exactly. So today's is supposed to be 7.38 or 7.39. Oh, okay. Yes. And that's where you can all join your family for dinner. Exactly. Oh, uh, well, um, if those are celebrating Ramadan, I hope you enjoy your family dinner and appreciate, I know it's all about appreciation of what you have in life, and I think that is a great, great philosophy. So thank you very much for watching us tonight, and thank you, Vivian. Thank you, are Vivian. You're amazing. <laughs> I've had so much. Should we do this again next Sunday? Let's do it. Oh, my gosh. Do you, want, do you want us back? We would love that. So thank you very much, and don't forget, tomorrow I have my show at 7 p.m., and from the 5th onwards... Keep your eyes peeled on our Instagram and on this website. You're going to see the rest of the team in a different part of the world. <laughs> so very exciting things ahead. Thank you very, very much. Love you too, Sandy. Thank you and good afternoon.